Good game. Yeah. That was... You don't expect that one out of Scary Games Friday. Right? Yeah. Scary you Games Friday. Save that one for Tear Jerker Monday. <laughs> yeah, Scary, scary <laughs> Games Friday is like, oh, it's another FNAF game. Wait a minute. Not like, oh, let's have Tattletail. Actual, like, right? Oh, no, it's an evil Furby. Not, wow, I'm having like... <laughs> like a very visceral reaction to like a very serious game. Yeah. It was awesome. So awesome good. job. This so, was fantastic. So good. Hello internet. Welcome to game. So scary. Wow. Hey guys and welcome to GT Live. TGIS GM guys. TGI SGM. Thank goodness it's Scary Games Monday. Monday. So uh, when last we left you guys on Friday afternoon, we were playing a game, a Taiwanese horror game called Detention. And uh, because we were really excited to see the ending of it, and as we looked forward at the week of games that we want to play on the stream, it didn't really, we're like, oh, we got to fit it in somewhere. And so we ended up fitting it in today. So we put it on the scariest day of all, Monday. Monday. Spooky Monday. That is what we're up to today. Uh, we continue the story of Ray and Harry Way. Yes. Ray, Ray and Harry Way, Way. Uh, Ray, Ray and Harry Way? Who are in this weird dreamlike state uh, last time we slit Way's throat. I was about to say, it's really just Ray who's in there now. Cause, what? cause we lost Harry a while back. Harry, no, Harry, we lost Harry. Yeah, uh, by our own hand, we actually had to slit his throat to get his blood to unlock a puzzle that we could have solved through combinatorial mathematics, but or, chose or not to. Or just an etching. Right. Right. I no, we needed the blood step. No. We needed right. the blood. So anyway, uh, we are, basically the theory goes, what we believe is happening is that Ray is feeling some sort of guilt or loss about turning her fellow students and or teachers into the communist police. We think so. There's a lot of like underground SS kind of big brother, 1984, however you want to think about it, stuff going on in this in this game. It's all about... Um, like repressing the communist sympathizers who are from mainland China because there's this war going Man, on. Nothing says Monday quite like the sentence repressing the communist sympathizers uh, in mainland China. <laughs> That's the scariest thing about today's live stream. That <laughs> sentence right there. Let's begin or continue. I'm going to say hi in the chat meanwhile. Uh, let's see. Bernus48 uh, says chat is so fast. Yes, it is. All right. So when we let, sorry. You can, you can go. Are you sure? Yes. I think, we, I think we should totally give a synopsis. Is that what you were going to do? No, we already did the synopsis. Oh, we did? Did I miss the synopsis? Where are we? Don't worry about it. We're wandering around the school. There are dead zombies who come after us, but if we feed them rice, they go away. Correct. It's really good. It's really good rice. So... Okay, okay. I'm going to say hi to a few more people in the chat. Um... Pika Rat 297, please give me a shout out. Shout out to Pika Rat 297. Shout out. <laughs> shout out. That was a very, very enthusiastic shout out. I really, I take those very seriously. So, very exciting. <laughs> uh, Owen Emmons says, we have standardized testing. This is actually a metaphor for standardized testing, running around your school when it's full of zombies and, and you're alone in the dark. No, I'm just kidding. Standardized testing can be, actually be really cool. You're a big fan of standardized testing. I love standardized tests. Good luck with your standardized testing. It's much less scary than this game. So here we go. Okay. This is This is where we last left off. We were trying to get to the counselor's office because yes. we got a scary phone call from a clearly not at all demonic presence saying, come to the counselor's office, I'm waiting for you. And, yeah. and, and our character Ray's like, oh, that was weird that it knew my name. What a <laughs> not scary voice at all. I'm going to go to the counselor's office. And here we are. Ray doesn't seem like a bright one. Again, could have used the etchings instead of slitting her friend's throat. It's but did locked. she? No. Did our candle just change? <gasps> oh. So this is where we last left off last time. We get chased, spoiler alert, by this large, oh, creepy yeah, creature. Oh yeah, this guy. 
which yeah, I, the heck is part scary? of me wants to just get caught by it because I'm curious what it is. Oh, no. Ooh, can I look at my bulletin board? No, I can't. Oh. <laughs> Stop and read the bulletin Calendar. board. Calendar! <laughs> Extracurricular activities. I wanted to sign up for drama club. Uh, All right. Girls softball. All right. Made it. Excellent. Okay. Ooh, Zetabyte had a snow day. Yay for Monday. Woo -woo. Sweet. Do they have rain days in L.A.? Has anyone lived in L.A. long enough to know if they have rain days here? I feel like they should. No one no one can deal with it when it rains in L.A. Amitabha Buddha. Amitabha. Amitabha Buddha. Okay. Someone wrote Buddha's name all over the wall. Okay. All right. As, as you sometimes are inspired it's, to do. I was about to say, that seems like a safer thing to write on the wall. That seems fine. Okay, so the counseling record Ooh. is what we read last time. So, age 17, mother is a housewife, mm -hmm. negative troubled attitude, constant tardiness, gradually improving, hey. but requires follow-up, encouraged leisure activities such as reading or playing video games. Right. Probably not distressful ones like Taiwanese horror games called Detention. Mm -hmm. Signed by faculty members. Uh, Miss Yin was mm -hmm. one of the ones that we think has been turned into the communists. Yes. Officer Bai... Instructor Bai, and then Principal Shen. And Principal Shen, we know, is a military veteran. Also, the counselor is apparently a fourth grader, judging by the handwriting. I'm just saying. I think this is handwriting. This is like, hey, stupid Americans, we've translated it for you. Ah. <laughs> I don't know. Okay. So we pop out here. So this is where we last left off. Which is no longer in the school, or at least it's in a different part of the school. We're in her bedroom. Is it, Are we actually... my? I sleep much better on my own bed. So is this actually me? Do you think this is actually my bed? I think so. Or I think have this we is her room. I think or is this, this is... Frambo style where we're actually in someone else's personality? No, she says my bed. Foggy outside. I can barely see the road. Maybe it's her dorm room? I could Because it actually looks quite a bit like a dorm room if you look at it. They say, they say I should enjoy my youth, but I find it difficult. Oh, this is Frambo. <laughs> what happens after graduation? Where should I go? Will I end up like mom? No. Scariest fate of all. Looking like my mother! No! Not mom jeans! Stop <sighs> worrying so much, Ray. Life moves on regardless. Be hopeful. Mom jeans aren't so bad. Right? They leave lots of breathing room. They're coming out with tasteful female styles all the time. Fewer and fewer pleats every day. At least this weekend's gonna be... What? What? People often say, do not look into a mirror at night. Why not? Well, you, you already broke that rule. She's like, the first time's okay. Any more than one time, it's too much. Someone cleaned the desk up for me. Probably mom. I feel like there's no privacy in this house. Oh, so this is her, like, this it is her home like home. It, doesn't it? Yeah. Okay. It's over here. They're fighting again. Uh... I'll never get used to this. Hmm. I'll never get used to this. What's down here? What? Mom's throwing my stuff away without telling me. Old photograph in the trash, okay? Oh. Photograph found in the trash. Quote Re written on it. Remember, hope is a good thing. Maybe the best of things and no good thing ever dies. That's nice. Why would mom throw that away? Maybe I'm dead, Steph. Mom. I hate it. I hate it when she throws away my artsy, angsty photographs. After I die. This is Jeez. basically, I mean, long story short, this is basically the Taiwanese version of Life is Strange. <laughs> oh, feeling a bit sleepy now. I should go back to bed. It's part of mom's dowry. A well-built closet. Ah. <laughs> I should go back to bed. Man, exploring the five I interactable <gasps> items in my room has really exhausted Ooh, me. Taking it right out of me. I walked like eight steps. Go to bed. That's almost double digits. All right, let's go to bed. Okay. What horrific thing is going to attack me in the middle of the night? If a paper plane could whisk my dreams away from here. Hmm. I did notice the paper planes last time. If it could what? What's going to happen? Oh, where I could wake up and find myself in a foreign land to start a new life as a stranger to all. Oh, how wonderful that is. You could probably just go like 50 miles down the road. She's a student. So, I'm just saying, you don't really have to go that far. The world has a lot of people in it. You don't have to go that far to be a stranger. Okay, so now we're back in the auditorium. Okay. So for those of you who missed time number one, the auditorium is basically 
where we found her to begin with. As, we were starting the game as a different character named Way. Mm -hmm. We named him Harry Way. We found her here. She didn't really know what was going on. And then we flashed forward to like a dream state where all of a sudden Harry Way was hanging upside down and dead. Where we eventually slit his throat. He sure was. Uh, so we we're sure back did. at the auditorium one more time. So interesting. The command post. So this is the middle of the field. Like, like a battle? A command post? And we have a bunch of paper airplanes. Oh, so we're out. Okay, so oh, I guess this outdoors. isn't the auditorium. This oh, is a okay. different place. Okay. It just they're they're setting up some parallelism. It's all old and battered. Yeah, it's thematic. Mm. So many paper airplanes. Someone has a lot of detention for those. Ah, <laughs> uh, ah. Uh. I was never good at doing paper airplanes. The fields collapsed here. Everything's flooded into a rim river of crimson mud. It doesn't seem to be an end. That ink factory upstream is just killing us all. That red ballpoint pen factory. <laughs> <laughs> those, river, those rivers of blood just aren't what they used to be. Am I right? That cherry jam packaging facility. Smuckers! <laughs> Curse you and your jam spills! Our flagpole stand. The rope keeps knocking on the poles. Good observation. Wow. Excellent. Way to be detail oriented, oh, friends. Really important detail. <sighs> Thanks, Steph. Thanks for commenting on the excitement of our stream mm -hmm. today. <laughs> Walk this way. Get me to the zombies. <sighs> They're called lingards, okay, Steph? As in, my soul has a linger. They're also called wendigos or whatever. Don't you remember Until Dawn? Here we go. So now we're on the streets. This store is completely blocked. This should be the Puppetry Club's workshop. Oh, the Puppetry Club is closed. Oh, man. I can't imagine oh, why. Oh, man. We're going to go. go in there. We're running into some creepy puppets, man. The Puppetry oh. Club. No, my favorite Friday night hangout. Nothing like Mary, like nothing like uh, marionettes in the dark. That's what everybody wants. A puppet see. theater on a hand-drawn cart. During summer break, the boys in class would use this as their battle tank. Fortunately, they broke the wheels. Oh. Wow, wow. Boys are the worst. There's a note. Ooh, the Lantern Spectre. Uh oh. Hmm. It's a new spear we gotta fight. Lantern Ooh. Spectre. Illustration of the Lantern Spectre. If you chance upon a Lantern Spirit, avert your gaze and, and stand, stand unmoving. Up. Okay. When it comes near, still your breath. Do not panic and it will keep on moving. Okay, so. Okay, we just have to hold our breath as it goes by. Turn away, stand still, hold our breath. And is it coming? I'm sure it's coming. Um, it's gotta be. Right? It's gotta be right around the corner. They. Oh, it's getting dark. They so, wouldn't just tell me that oh, for geez. my own he health, would they? Ooh, let's go in. Oh, is this still the? It's a similar layout to the school. It is. Where are we? Oh, Ooh, boy. creepy jars. Oh, what? With a hand. The glass beakers here are from our biology lab. Uh, oh, they're holding puppets. puppets. They're holding puppets. Oh, no because sweat. Why wouldn't the biology lab beakers of, like, formaldehyde be holding puppets? That makes perfect sense. You got to keep them fresh. Yep. Uh, why not? A large mass, mass of puppets. Hanging from the ceiling. Oh, great. Oh, great. Ooh. What can I burn in the fire? Puppet. <laughs> what do we got? A brick furnace. Okay. I remember back then, Mom said she burned spirit money to bless our health and good fortune. Hmm. Always thought of it as closer to dealing with the devil. Oh, oh uh-oh. All right. Let's make a deal with the devil, shall we? Uh-oh. What's this? A, no. I know that's a brick furnace. I want this little matchbook right here. Okay. I Bare, guess, guess that's barely, barely not. Stuck to the stuck to the purpose. It's not going anywhere. All right. I would think matches would be helpful. So presumably, that tells me that we need to find some spirit money. Right. Hmm. That's not. Number one Hitsu, uh, Hitsugaya fan says, "I'll never look at puppets the same way again." Oh boy. Ooh, upstairs, down. Ooh, there's so many options. Once you've seen puppets in formaldehyde, how can you how can you look at them any other way? Right. That's what I always say. Right. Ooh, okay. 
Eduardo Perez says, so many memories. I'm not sure if they're referring to like the memories that the girl that that Ray has here in the game or like, oh, this game is bringing back <laughs> such fond memories of the last time you killed someone in your deserted school. Ah, uh, yes. Uh, you know? Ah, uh, those good old days of me ratting out my fellow classmates during the Red Scare. Ah, uh, no. I remember them fondly. No need to follow up with us to let us know. It's okay. It's all right. All right, so... Wait. So this is all covered up with roots. The gateway to the ceiling or to the roof is blocked. Mossy smell permeates. Okay. okay. Here we go. <laughs> Someone in the chat says, "I wish the title were true," which is "School's Out Forever." Huh. Clickbait. Ah, Jason. Clickbait, Jason. There are various films on this rack. They seem to be tangled together. Oh boy. And oh, oh creepy we'll movie. Watch a movie. Creepy movie. The film in the media room is being projected from here. Our military education class often played political propaganda. Oh boy. The instructor always has a million things to say about whatever happens in the film. Are there any other films I can play? Probably. It's either this one or Rocky IV. The selection is very slim. So we need something that'll. You so might we, as well go with the propaganda. So we need spirit money. Yes. And we need something to untangle a bunch of film. Yep. That is that is what I'm walking. Maybe some scissors even. Also a door. A door to the outside there we go. would help. Ooh. Oh boy. Hello. Hey. Jeez. Whose notification was that? That was scary. Your notification a bit scared me. Concerned. So this is the actual Oh. Oh boy. Oh that's we were lucky that's enough him, to watch right? a movie as part of a lecture. No, Maybe? that's just ribbons in the wind. No, the lantern over there. Oh, yeah, that lantern's going to attack us. Oh, yeah. 100% totally. guaranteed that lantern will try to kill us. Confirmed. Ooh, that's spooky. Oh, jeez. Oh, this is just what? disturbing. Oh, no. Man, these, these film projects that they constantly assign us, garbage. Words all moldy now. The slogan reads, leave your death in the hands of others. What? Uh, the AV Club and their experimental filmmaking, man. Never understand it. An unmarked grave embedded in the middle of the room. Okay. Shouldn't be anything buried underneath. There shouldn't be. <laughs> what an observation you make there, Ray. <laughs> That's not foreboding at all. What a thing to say. Here we go. There are three unlit incense sticks here. Take it. Take them. No. Do it. No. Light them in the furnace. Yeah, exactly. Take them. All right. It's going to let. All right. Fine. Yeah. Take them. Here we go. Here we go. Ah! I knew it was going to See? Item received. Incense. That's exciting. Now what's it say? The grave of Way. Way. Harry Way. Harry Way. No. Oh, right, Way, he already died. Yes, we slit his throat. Is the legacy of the deceased always just a mere rock? That's deep. Oh. Okay. 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 All right. All right. Yep, okay. We, we did. We're, yep. we're, right, we're set here. There we go. Oh, man. Right? These student film projects, man. The cinematography leaves some to be desired. The slogan reads, patriotism demands of us sustained sacrifice. <sighs> When did all this writing appear? Snitcher. <gasps> there it is. Oh, is this about an informer? Uh -oh. Could this be about me and my, I'm assuming, repressed memories? Oh, yeah. About tattling on my fellow students? I bet it is. Mm -hmm. Oh, it's, yeah. See, it's gone. Yep. Uh, I'm going to walk over okay. there. I'm going to hopefully cue it to attack. And right, then, and then... Actually, it doesn't look like we'll be able to get past, huh. does it? Just get ready to hold your breath. Right. Oh, boy. Oh, no, we're going to wow. like lantern land. Wow, you can really go over there, but there is nothing to see or click on or do. All right, well, fine. That's weird. Right? That is, that's unsettling. Oh, boy. It's going to attack us. Don't worry. <laughs> give it, give it time. Oh, here he is. Oh, okay. oh, look at him. Oh, he's so tall. All right, all right, all right, you can walk. Yeah. I want to see us, like, 
hold our breath, and then just like scooch back right. towards <laughs> do, do like a, a breath holding moonwalk. Hey, friend. Uh, okay, there you go. There you go. Okay. Hold God, your breath. He's so slow. He is so slow. I can't hold my breath that long. Go. Oh, we're go. Just gonna um, pass right out. Up. Ah! <laughs> Come on. Oh, I'm, I'm so dead. Breathe. Oh, I'm gonna breathe. Oh. Maybe all he had to do was kind of smell if we had washed our hair recently. Your Pantene like, Pro-V is very nice. Right? Nailed it. Look at that. Like a champ. I've got the urge to earn them. And are those, are those okay. natural botanicals? Natural botanicals. All right, so we don't need to go here. Let's go to the furnace room, I guess? Uh-huh. It's all here. Look at that. Woo! Take that lantern, man! Nice! You ain't got none, son! We can't go through that, that locked gate, right? We cannot. Okay. I can also try this door. This door is nah. locked on the other side. Okay, so that's okay. good. Go down. This should lead to the atrium. Hmm. Let's go into the creepy basement! Sweet. Ooh. Oh, no. Ooh. Oh, no. Ooh, this is, this is spooky. Oh, and our thaw. Ooh, this We're gonna is... have to dry our socks and shoes now. Right. A kneeling figure with a wooden token on its back. Oh boy. Can't really tell who it is with a hood on its head. <laughs> let's, That's let's okay. Leave, let's leave it at that. Do we really need to... some mysteries are just better left unknown. Wooden unknown. stocks and shackles. Oh great. Bit of dried blood on the edges. Figure, there's some blood on its hood. Along with some melted cheese. It's just weird. <laughs> Ooh, look at this. He was eating a pizza look at and this then creepy he altar. died. The temple's divine incense burner. Before we pray, Mom always lights three incense sticks. Hey! She tells yeah. the gods her name and birthplace, then launches into a spiritual dribble. Told you. Perfect. Told you to steal the dead guy's incense. She often lays her many problems and wishes upon them. Why does she not tell a real person? Instead, they fall upon an invisible god. All right, so let's light our incense then. Yeah. And then you were, sprint you were in down there. here. I know. Oh, spooky room! Oh, boy. <laughs> okay, spooky room. What do you want? I think we should light it along the way. This cell is empty. It smells like rotting plants. What? I think we should go ahead and light the incense, no? Fine. I think we should light the incense. Fine. I wanted to explore more of the creepy basement, but you know. Oh, I thought we would just keep going. Wait, where, where are you going? Well, because the incense is up here. Or I mean the uh, lighter for the incense is up here. Oh, the There's lighter. The oh, oh, I didn't know. I didn't know we couldn't light it now. Do I look like in my inventory I have a match and or lighter? The fact is, the answer is no. I thought maybe we could do a little focus of the spectacle or something. <laughs> ah, yes, the classic focus of the spectacle. Indeed. Oh, am I gonna have to like run downstairs and get these pack of incense? It says burning incense. Let your prayers reach the gods through the smoke. Okay. okay. Burn my incense. It doesn't do anything. I bet it does. Let's try now. This doesn't do anything. Huh? I beg to differ, game. I I would mm. actually challenge that assertion uh, with the fact that it's like, hey. Fire plus incense I don't equals know why burning we incense. Can't it's uh, we're gonna have to. What we're gonna have to do is matches. place the incense, and then we're gonna have to probably come back oh, up and go grab get the, the matches. matches. That's what I'm assuming. We'll see. We'll, we'll try it. If not, there's a well, whole. Well, here, let's let's check out the rest of the floor anyway, since we don't have everything we need to actually do it in one step. I thought it was like, bam, throw up the incense, keep on trucking, but no, it's a multi-step process. Ugh. This is just a disturbing little basement scene. No. Uh, incense. Plus, I do as mom does with incense in hand, ignoring the kinds of prayers she'd prefer. I ask the gods only for a way to live as myself. Ooh, deep. Um, I, apparently I could like them myself. Oh, maybe they were already lit from the grave? What was that sound? Oh, uh, no. Bet you did something good. Tell me something good. It's a surprise you, cake. Bet you the suffering people have suddenly come to life. Oh boy. Yeah, okay. Yeah, yep, yeah, yep. Yeah. Mm. Oh, his cell's open! Oh no. Hey, buddy. Hey. Hi, friend. Oh, God. Happy 
Happy Monday, everybody. We are such, don't you remember from when you were alive? We're like BFF. Okay, here okay? we go. Okay. Prison gate is open. The wood token on the statues, it's a statue? Oh. Is it? Is it really a sure? statue? Oh, received a token. Oh, that's nice. Wait for the jump scare. Wait for the jump scare. It's coming. Wooden token taken from the figure in the basement cell. What is a token? What does that mean? Well, we will find out together, Seth. The only tokens I know are like the kind you get at Dave and Buster's and Chuck Arcade Cheese. tokens, yeah. Yes. Okay. Also, maybe maybe I have to burn the token. Spooky, scary. Cells empty. What else we got over in Deathland down here? What kind of criminals do they lock up here? Ones that you've told on, Ray! Right? Another kneeling figure. Who are these supposed to be? Your friends, family, comrades. Not comrades, though, because then they would have been, you know, sacrificed to the, the communist police. Uh, spirit money. Hey, there Whoa. we go. Hey -o. Dollar, dollar bills. Spirit cash. Rocking the dollars. A metal door, it's locked. Yep. Okay, so we got As money. As in life, I oh, have Oh, wait, 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 wait. Oh. Yep, I have a feeling. It's gonna be mo money, mo problems for us. <laughs> <laughs> so true, Steph. Uh -huh. Oh, here. Ooh. Hey. Hey. I, I see you standing <laughs> there. You can have your tokens back. It's okay. I didn't want to play ski ball anyway. Oh, no, no, no. <laughs> oh, all right. Cool. Great. Oh boy. This ain't spooky at all. I'm just gonna run past you. Do, 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 do. <laughs> nope. No thanks. No, don't want any. Thank you so much. Right. Thanks for playing. All right. And yeah. away we go. Uh, let's burn some money, shall we? Right. Whew. All right. Uh, the sound design for this game is not. I mean, it's great. Let's. It's not good in the greatest way possible. <laughs> all right. Throw all our money in the fire. Oh, otherworldly spirits, I offer this spirit money to ask for your protection. Ooh, this please. Protection, I could use that. Yeah! The fire went out. The furnace is hmm. suddenly gone cold. Is something in there? How can this be? It should have been reduced to ashes if it was inside. What is it? It's a fan. A fan? Behind my face? I was hoping for like a gun that we could use to shoot the zombies. <laughs> what kind of protection is this, spirits? Gosh! Steph, it's a fan, okay? It's protection. What is she me. what is she gonna do? Cool them yes. vigorously? Yes! Blow them away? The fan is a very strong item in Super Smash Brothers. You could throw it at them and it could knock them off the stage. <gasps> Fan made of feathers that appeared in the furnace after burning spirit money. I don't know why know. it's still intact. This is Ray we're talking about. Chun Li, she is not. I'm <laughs> just saying. All right. Oh, <laughs> the puppets. It doesn't do anything. Are you sure? Blow, blow my fan. Maybe they're just sort of waving in the breeze because you Wait. fan oh, them. Oh, they grab me. Grabbed by the puppets. Ooh, hey. Another another flashback sequence. Hmm. Uh, or something. Dream sequence? Okay. Sequence inspired by be being grabbed by all the creepy marionettes who I who I gave life to. I gave a gift that I gave life. Basically, Ray is the marionette from FNAF. Confirmed. I was about to say, this is this Wait. is basically exactly FNAF. Okay. These human-like objects. Are filled with evil, evil over time. Okay. What? Deal with them as with the lingered. Oh. Hold your breath. Hold your breath and walk slowly. Human-like objects? I'm assuming that means puppets. I think so. Right, like the marionettes and yeah. stuff. Yeah. Oh, boy. Okay. Uh. Cool. Thanks. Cool, man. Foul thoughts gather and accumulate until they one day, taking on a life of their own, they begin to twist into a monstrous storm. Oh boy. This 
So, moral of this story is hold your breath and walk. Right. Hold your breath. Keep walking. Keep walking. Keep walking. Come on. Ugh, oh she's my gosh. So slow. Oh my gosh. Oh, you're so close. Oh, come oh, on. Oh yes, Ugh. made it. Yay! Bizarre. Phew. All right. Oh, at Hockey Gamer 313 on Twitter says, rightfully so, scariest part of the game, as always, the fan. <laughs> <laughs> right? This is basically the Taiwanese version of FNAF. Clap right? and a half for that. We've got, we've got the fan. We've got marionettes. Next thing I know, there's gonna be some like robotic bunny jumping out from one of these doors. Yeah. Practically the exact same story. At Cheshire Kane, on the other hand, completely unimpressed. She's dead. Hashtag GT Life. I don't think she's dead. I am agnostic. Uh, about the state ooh, of her I aliveness. I want to Pick up the save note. my game first. And yeah, then I'll pick up the okay. Note. Alter for praying. Save. Yes, please. And At Lilycat12, also, we'll never look at puppets the same way again. Okay. Let's see. Hi. Hey by Wu Chang. Oh boy. Black and white in permanence, according to legends that they are two ancient officials. During a routine inspection, misfortune befell them and they perished trying to protect one another. Hmm. During a routine inspection, misfortune befell and they perished each other. Okay. The Lord of the Dead, seeing their loyalty, appointed them the duty of messengers of death. It was it was then that people who died would see them arrive to claim their souls. Oh, okay. Well, if she can see them, then maybe, maybe she is there. Maybe that theory does have a lot of weight to it. Do, do, do. <laughs> maybe I spoke a second too soon. Maybe. Perhaps. There were, and thank you, thank you at Alex D. Great One, someone else who was hoping we'd get like a gun or something. Right. I'm just saying something a little more self defense -y than a fan. Two figures are carved on the door. You just read about them. Mm -hmm. You just I read them. These are supposed to be guardians, but they look more like the high by Wu Chang. Okay, good. Okay. Oh, okay. Good. All right. Well done. Fair, fair enough. Fair enough. Their hands look like they should be holding something. What could they be missing? Oh, oh. Oh, there it hey, is. Hey, there one we go. One for you and one for you. Sweet. He's like, no, I'm the fan guy. A chill air drifts inward. Uh -uh. Oh, the gates of death. Uh -uh. Right? We, we feel fairly confident that this is the gates of death. Oh, yeah. Right? Okay. Good. <laughs> yeah, anyone else? Anything other than gates of Hades? Okay. Anyone? No. Anyone? No? no. Okay, good. Jason? All right. Chris? No? We're all good? Gates, gates of heck? Mm -hmm. Great. Awesome. Fantastic. Ooh, hello, statue. Oh, nice. A copper statue of the president. It can be seen from almost anywhere in the school. He's always watching. Then why are we just sitting here? <laughs> oh, oh, Chris, oh. clap and a half. Hey. 20 points, House Chris Door. Well done. Excellent. Well done, sir. Tip of the cap. Oh. Hey, oh. That doesn't look like Donald Trump. Hey, oh. Hey, oh. Mm -hmm. Japanese built wooden building, the floors are always creaking. Mm. The teacher's offices are inside, okay. Oh, that's exciting. All right, so that's where we, uh, this is where we came from. This is a different door, okay. Let's explore this first room first. Ah, oh, no, let's go ahead. All right. Ooh, in the meantime, this, this spoke to me. At Cole Helzel on Twitter mm -hmm. said, Hey guys, my friends are having a game to see who can get a shout out or a clap and a half. Can I get one, please? I'm very competitive. All right, Cole, Cole, I totally relate. As to someone you. who can relate to being very competitive, clap and half for that. Yes. We understand that. <laughs> so, congratulations, a winner is you. <laughs> Making dreams happen here on GT Live today. Sending souls, sending souls to heaven. Sending people to probably the firing squad of, of communism and helping you win contests with your friends. That's yes. all in a day's work for us here on a Monday, GT Live. Welcome to GT Live. Welcome. Those of you who haven't joined, this is all par for the course. <laughs> Fair enough. Windows yep. are covered in protective talismans. Great. This is the safest room in the game, presumably. Uh, oh, not another spooky phone call. Oh, I'm going to have to dial it. 911. <laughs> Nine. 
I have to pick up the receiver to dial Steph. Nine. I'm, I'm not the one who doesn't know how to use the phone. Nine. One. What? The achievement. What would make you think <laughs> this would work? Awesome. Clap and a half game. Nice. Well played. <laughs> what would make you think that would work? Awesome. Uh, I don't know. 911. It's universal. 362. 36. Oh yeah, the, the code for the last That's the code, one. sure. Eh. There's, there's nothing important on the bookshelves here. And isn't it 623? Oh, just, just. I don't know. That could be wrong. Here, what do you want, Jason? 623? Wasn't it 623? Yeah. Six. It's not gonna work. Two. Two. I'm just doing it to appease Jason. Three. All right, it did work. And of course, no achievement. I don't know how many numbers are in a Taiwanese telephone number. Telephone number. So. Right. They're always. Writing out foreign phone numbers, and maybe people who live in Europe have it a bit easier because there are multiple countries that use like the same number of digits at least in the phone numbers. Yep. It is so confusing for us here in the U.S. If it doesn't have three numbers, a dash, three numbers, a dash, and four numbers, we don't know what to do with it. All right, so we got the roof key. That's <laughs> oh, oh, boom! I'm just gonna. Oh, actually. What are you using? Mm. It smells delightful. Chanel in the fat. Oh, we need a shampoo step. You know? Mm -hmm. Who am I kidding? And I'm just gonna go to the deep deep deep. Okay. Do, 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 do. Nailed it. Sweet. Didn't suspect a thing. The teacher's headquarters could really use some upkeep, man. Yeah, right? The music room, there's a piano inside. It was probably last used during our freshman chorus competition. When they reallocated all that money from educational funding to propaganda films, things really went downhill. Right? Uh, uh, what do we got back here? We have music class scheduled every semester. It's mostly used as a testing center, though. Great. All right. What do we got in her? Oh. Oh, I remember this from... What the is like this? phone call from the phone call earlier. This is gonna just like jump out and be freaky. Ready? Ready? Yes. In the middle of the room hangs a bird cage. Okay. A puppet lies locked inside. Here we go. It's got a hood on. I've never seen the style before. Yeah, I've never seen the like creepy death march puppets. Let's remove its hood, maybe. Uh-uh. No? Uh-uh. No? Uh-uh. Really? This is disturbing. Can I give you? I want to give someone my necklace, darn it. Right? Common gate key, old and rusty. Great, okay. That's <sighs> Cute. I expected that to be scarier. Man, looks like the testing didn't go so well. <laughs> right? Holy cow. Play for release or you're expelled. Chopsticks. <laughs> Matthew, was that a joke about it being a Taiwanese game? Ah, oh, it wasn't. That was <laughs> I shake your hand for that though. It's a pun. I, I thought you were. I, I no. thought you were being stereotypical. I was not. Gah. But, but I, I wish that it had been a joke. It's <laughs> <laughs> uh, <laughs> really funny. Um, okay, so the piano made me think of like, hey, there is a, like, you can see the bloody fingerprints on the piano, which makes me think that those are a clue to like the keys that you have to hit. Mm. However, I feel like there's still more that we're missing before we can solve that one. The hallway light switch. Yep, that's a thing. Yeah, <laughs> thank you. Thank you for that observation. So glad it's there, but not functional. <laughs> That you have no desire okay. to try it. The broadcasting room, there are some playback devices inside. Ooh, maybe we can fix the tapes. What is that in the corner? Is that a tree? Ooh, ooh, there are like faces in there. Oh, yeah. Oh, that's creepy. Oh, no. Broadcasting equipment, the speakers are emitting a small staticky sound. You can almost hear whispering. Oh, no. Great. That's not the radio, that's the tree. 
This should be used to switch tracks. Each tape usually has four tracks recorded on it. So I need a tape, huh? Okay. A large eight-track player. Eight-track player. Usually for school broadcast. The power's connected. Do I just need to stick the eight-track in? Yes, probably. All right. So we need an eight-track. Here, let's look at the creepy look faces the in the tree thing. This tree is grown through the wall. There are leaves all over the room. Moss grows on the door and windows. Uh, no? Not noticing any of the human faces Right? There, not going to comment on the dead people just living in the tree? That's that's not standard. Nothing nothing uh, to see there. That's no no cause for concern. Oh boy. Oh boy. Uh, okay. There are a number of people in the chat who are asking us to dial three sixes on the phone, ah. by the way. I mean, actually, like, a good number of people. So we we try to pay attention to the chat, although we do try to solve some of the puzzles ourselves because otherwise it's fun for no one. <laughs> um, well, that might not be the solution. That's just I know, fun. but it might, yeah. We'll maybe, try it. But maybe there's an achievement or something, so maybe we should try it. Yeah, when next, when next we are back in the phone room, we will try it. Yeah. A wooden puppet theater. I see it often when we visit the temple. There seem to be a couple of props on the theater. Climb the ladder and take a look. You betcha. Look, it's me. Right? This is it's me. A, it's a person hanging upside down dead, clearly. Well, I know, but I think it's me. Oh. All right, let's climb the ladder and take a look. Oh, no, it isn't me. Oh. It kind of looked like me, though, with the dress and stuff. It did, it did. All right, let's look at the creepy puppet. This scene. Is it trying to remind me of something? <laughs> that time, like, 30 minutes ago, where you slit someone's throat, maybe. Right? With your own hands. Ah? Uh, ah? Uh? A pair of mannequin hands. Is it set up for a puppet play? So we need puppets on these guys. Yeah. Okay, so we need an 8-track. We, we need all sorts of stuff. Yeah, there's a lot of stuff to do. Okay. We need an 8-track. We need puppets to put on the hands. We need something to remove the bag over the guy's head. Uh, we need a phone number. Yep. Holy cow. We need a lot of stuff. Something okay. stuck in the tree. Eight hey, track. Eight track. Woo! In the tree. One and done. Eight track. Okay. Four tracks. One is labeled. This one is labeled. Oh, prohibited. prohibited. Oh, man. Contents are censored. Okay. Okay. And we're done. Okay. All right. Oh, boy. What spooky thing is going to come out and attack me? This is one of those games that is just, like, unsettling the whole time. Like, the jump scares aren't too bad. Like, some of them have been scary. Like, in, in part one, there were some scary moments. But, like, what really gets me in this one is just, like, the atmosphere of it all. I don't know. Bet Noir says, it's perfectly normal to have the deceased faces of your friends stuck in a tree trunk. As you do. As you do, right? Oh, no. The Cheetah Den informs us that... 211 is child security. That's interesting. That is interesting. Shoot. Is this the 8 track room? The 8 track room was the last one we visited, right? Yeah. It's too dark to see any. God, come on. Come on. You were literally just here. Right? Yeah, all right, let's go. Uh, Get in there. I can't. It's too dark. Uh, I have to look for the. Uh, okay. All right. Wait, where, all right. where was the switch? Shoot. Wait, there, there, it is, there, there it is. Okay, good. Here we go. Wait, it's gonna, like, something's gonna jump oh, out, Oh, right? totally. Ready, go! Oh, garbage. Come on. Oh, you are the worst! Come on. You are the worst! Ah! Oh, Lord. oh no. Oh, oh, hold your breath, hold your breath, hold your breath. Okay, wait, wait. Wait. Here, I'm just, I'm just here. Right? Ah. Just, I don't just even, go I don't in even the door. need to wait for him. I don't even need to wait. Sorry. He's, I like I like that he's not that threatening. It's just like, all right, bye. He's, right? And we're gone. Okay. Uh, all right. Ooh. Oh, that was scary. Let's do it. A track. Cool. This will not do us much good as non any form of Chinese speakers. Okay, 
Okay. All right, cool. Thanks, Steph. High five. High five for observation. I just wanted to make in case you were in case you were listening hard. That's what we, yep. Yeah. Okay. So it's descending five. Hold on. Da -da. Down. It's going up. Steph. Wait, hold on. Wait, sorry, sorry. I, if I'm mishearing it, I'm sorry. I here. Oh. Oh. Okay. Okay. Good. Good. Okay. We're good. Okay. Weird. Is it stuck? Can't change tracks anymore. So, hey, here's the clue you need. Okay. Okay. Good. Oh. Oh, we don't even oh, have to memorize come on. it. Oh, that makes it so much easier. Thanks, game. Phew. Where's my little buddy? Or tall buddy? Not so small buddy. That's great. I love okay, that it's broadcasting. Stuck in my head. Yeah, this is terrific. Excellent. Hey, creepy dummy. We're going to be back hey. to you in a second. Oh, yeah. You're going to be our friend pretty soon. So here's how many notes can we press? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Eight. Okay, good. Ooh, okay. That's Wait. starting note. Yeah. Oh, it's the, there's a, yeah. Okay. No. No, no, it's da da da. Yeah. Shoot. No. Shoot. Skip. Yep. There you there go. Metal sound comes from somewhere in the room. Yeah. Could it be the Papa K? Yes. Oh, oh, what? What? No. Oh, my gosh. Oh, what? God. 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 Oh. That wasn't as scary as a lot of the other ones. That, that wasn't as bad as some of the ones on Friday. I don't I know. I kind of lost it on Friday. I don't know. That was startling, though. That was, oh, the scary. Okay. Oh, you've got scare hair. That's Look, nice. Clap and a half for this game. What this game does that not a lot of other horror games does really, yeah, does really well, do really well, do really well, is uh, the fact that, like, it sets you up for the scare, for the scare. Man, I can't talk at all. It sets you, you up for the scare. It sets you up for the scare. It sets you up for the scare, and then it delivers it in a different way, right? Yeah. So like, oh, something open, and you're like, oh, it's gonna be the puppet. And then you pop into here, and it's like, oh, that's not what I expected. Or even the light switch, where it's like, oh, you're expecting something to happen when you flick it, yep. and then nothing happens, and you're like, oh, well, that was weird. I gotta solve something else. And then it, it, it like delays, it plays with your rhythms and timings yes. of what you expect to happen and what's so scary. And that is what causes the most effective scares, right? It scares you when you don't expect it to happen, which leads to really effective results. So well done. Good job, game. Well done, game. And I'm sure this is going to also scare me, right? I think maybe we just pick it up. It's, it's going to attack us though or something. I mean, it's going to freak out. Let's go for it. Here, I'm going to I'm expecting all sorts of scares here, puppet. Here we go. The cage door is open. On to you. Inside is a puppet. I'm going to take it. I think we just pick it up and it becomes one of the marionettes we need. Right. Maybe we put it in one of the hands. Yeah. Oh! oh! Okay. <laughs> nah. See, like I said. Okay, let's give it a high, high five. High five. Uh. Detached twisted hand. The fingerprints completely rubbed off. Oh. Ooh, that's interesting. Hooded puppet. Puppet found in the music room with a hood on its head. Its attire is strangely familiar. I think 
because it goes on the stage, you silly goose. Those poor fingers, man. I know. You could go for a manicure. Right? And like, just a repositioning of his fingers. I was about to fingers. say, need some of Chris's unscented lotion. <laughs> we need more unscented lotion over here, Chris. Uh, so we have one puppet. I'm presuming that we need two, though, right? Uh, yes, I think so. We also have the key to the roof still. Mm -hmm. Um... What else? Those are the only two rooms on this hall, though, right? Yeah, we still don't have editing stuff. It seems like we could still use something for that film room. Right. And I think there's another room over here. And we need that to dial explored. something on the phone. Uh huh. There's still a lot. I'm gonna drop off this puppet though, in case yeah. it unlocks. Since we're right here. In case, in case it, it unlocks, unlocks something. something. Yep. There you go. Puppet plus hand. There we go. Nice. The puppet with the hood over his head. This attire gives me a feeling of familiarity. Great. All right. Ah, great. All right, so that's that's it for now. Cool. All right. Oh wait, I heard something. It's just the wind you heard. Let's go this way. Okay. Ah, the door's oh, been locked. Oh, okay. Oh, nice. yes, that's great. Oh, that's a shortcut. Awesome. Fantastic. That makes me feel so much better. Right. Now there were there are that we don't have to ends. like yeah we don't have to keep running and sort like up Perfect. and down the same hallway. Cool. Now we can go upstairs right. for oh. more fun and excitement. Uh -huh. Up on the roof. On the rooftops of Taiwan. <laughs> oh, oh. <laughs> what a sight! Yeah. Oh, there we go. Did, did you did you not see me fall off the roof? No, what happened? Oh, there was, the, there was like uh, my body or a student's body or something <gasps> that jumped off the roof. <gasps> good catch. I, I, know, I know you were- Wait, good save. I, I, I was, didn't catch I her. was all Mary Poppins in that moment. There, there was no catching that happened. I just watched her fall. <laughs> no catching happened in that moment. <laughs> uh, projector Wait, film. I'm gonna, I've gotta watch the re replay because I really wanna see this. Where was it? You were, you were too busy with your- Oh, there it is. Yeah. It was it was way over in the corner. I also have a bit of a glare from where I'm sitting because there's a light and it reflects right on the far side. So if the far side is dark, I have trouble seeing details over Steph, there. I understand. Like when you're in the middle of your big solo- Hey, believe solo me, a lot of it was just Disney immersion that was going on, but there was also a little glare. <laughs> so the projector room, yeah, where was that guy? Projector room was, was it Down here? second floor or first floor? I don't remember. Uh, I do want to save though before we oh, continue, yeah. so I'm going to do that first. Mm -hmm. uh, there we go. So save, save progress, yep, great. Sweet. Okay, so we have saved, this takes us outside and the projector room was the Jason? Do you remember? Was projector room second floor, or was it, or was it in the teachers? Area? It wasn't in the teachers area. It must have been upstairs. But I, yeah, I think it was the only thing on the second on floor, the right? Second floor. That's what I thought. Mm -hmm. Okay. Let's go project whatever scary things it has in store for us. Let's go watch some propaganda. Oh, yeah, that's right, because that was also where we got the incense. Mm -hmm. That's right. Okay, who's going to jump out and attack me? XX Shadow XX1029. Steph is not blind. There was a glare! There was a glare! <laughs> Tell me if another student falls off the roof. You're sure the sun was in your eyes, huh? Ah! Uh, oh, right! Here we go. <gasps> Let's watch a movie. I wonder what's contained in this film. Yes. It's going to be horrible. Yeah, right. I put the film in from the roof. I should check out the projection in the media room. No, watch it from here. Right. You can watch it from the safety just, of this room. Just peek. You need full immersion. Oh. I, I, I need to be immersed in my work. Uh, the sound. The sound from the projection room All is right. just awful. It's just going to be another bad student <laughs> film. Okay, here we go. Wait for it. Wait for it. Wait for it. Oh my gosh, he's so slow. Wait for it. Okay, nope. Wait, there we go. There it is. Like when his lantern touches you, that's the time to like stop. Vidal Sassoon. <laughs> he's basically just like the creepy kid in class. 
<laughs> who like smells all the sits girls' hair. Sits behind. Like... And we're gonna go this way. Bye. How's it smell, Steph? Pretty good, right? Mm, you might use a shower. Thanks. <laughs> o two five. One. Steph, you can let write this down. O two five one two one. O two five one two one. Yep. O two five. Two five one two one. One two one. Yep. Two. Two. One. One. Perfect. And okay. And it repeats. O two five. Yep. So that's the phone number. Good. Perfect. We can try. One. We can still try six six six. Uh, yeah, we should try that first anyway. We could also do four one one. Mm. What's the four one one, guys? Give us the deets. We could. We could also do lol. Raffle copter. I'm That's sure just all getting of those ridiculous. Will work. I'm sure all of those will work. Domino's? Anyone have the number for Domino's? <laughs> order, order some takeout pizza, as you do. No one's coming to rescue me, but can I at least have a large pepperoni stuffed crust? Uh, do I want to take that way or the other way? Let's take the other way, actually. Okay. I feel like they, the game would expect me to take that way. <sighs> right? Because the game's like, oh, that's the shortcut way. My best gameplay experience is programmed for me to go this way, so I think I'm going to go the other way. Yeah. <laughs> you ain't scaring me, game. Like in save again. <laughs> totally scaring me, game. Right? <laughs> save. Boom. 8 Metzger says, oh dear, this game. Right, this game, man. This is intense. Avery Smith is intense. says, first stream, can I get a stab and a half? Yeah, you can. <laughs> okay. <laughs> uh, Emma Doodle asks, what are they playing? We're playing Detention. A Taiwanese horror game. Okay. Annie Moose says, my name is Philip. Thanks, Annie Moose. But I think her name is Annie Moose. Okay, here we go. Be proud of who you are, Annie Moose. Let's dial. Okay. The, get ready for another jump scare, I'm sure. What is it? Zero, Zero two, five. You didn't want six, six, six. Two. Oh, well, oh, yeah, do that oh, first. Oh, you're totally first. right. Okay, wait, let me hang up. Put down the receiver. Okay, well, all right, wait. Okay. Gotta do 666. Six, six. Yeah, good catch. Thank you. Here we go. Six. And gang. <laughs> Number of the beast, six. And six. Achievement? No, no. All right. Nothing. Sorry, ah, sorry guys. We tried. The okay. game does not have the same sense of humor that uh, we, we, we do. Right. So. Zero, two. Although they did appreciate 911. Zero, two, five. Two. Oh, okay, five. Five. There you go. Okay. Uh, one. One. Two. Two. One. One. Two. Two. One. Hang up the phone, please. I th yeah, I think yeah. I think I think that did not go. Shoot. I did not dial that correctly. It's you. Think, it's you, newfangled kid. You've never used a dialer. I, I, I know how to do that. It's just hard to operate with a mouse. Sure. Here, okay. Sure zero. 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 Here. Damn it! Zero. Zero. <laughs> Good. Two. 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 Five. Five. <laughs> I love rotary phones. One. One. Two. Two. One. One. Two. There. No, there's oh, no more. there we go. That's it. I guess it just repeated at the end. Here we go. What spooky thing? The jump scare's gonna come when we hang up, isn't it? Mm -hmm. That's what's gonna happen. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's just ringing. Do you accept charges from from beyond the grave? Why, yes, I'll accept those charges. <laughs> Nah, never mind. Right? It's too it's much. It's like, collect call from the Graham Reaper. Oh, Miss Fang. Oh. Your country oh, appreciates no. your assistance. Oh, no. See, so, so I did. So she was report, she reported someone. Your country appreciates your assistance. Yes. This was like the number to report a communist sympathizer. Probably, yeah. What's left is only the dial tone. Oh, man. Wait, what, what are you doing? What's going on? I did not control this. Okay. I, oh I, am in no, I am in no charge over this moment. We've got protection charms. 
Maybe he's here's, just the communist. Here's Is that the what thing. He's <laughs> if, if protection charms work in this game, can't I just like load up my body with Earrings, protection charms? Like you know. just just cover myself up, <laughs> like make a dress out of protection charms, like a like a nice skirt or something. Ah. There you go. There's nothing important on the bookshelves. Great. Well, then why did you ask me what? Why was me looking at the bookshelves an option? That right. Game. All right. There's also this weird smoke emanating from the flowers in the corner. Right. I'm un I'm unsure about that. Or bugs. One of the two. They're crawling up the wall. It's Protective strange. talismans. Great. Well, well, coast must be clear now. Let me right. Ah, uh, puppet. Oh, hey, friend. Puppet puppet, who's got the puppet? Ooh, Ooh, military, military police, police puppet. puppet. The must have for any puppet co collection. Wait. The, the old military police puppet. Do I that? mean, it is the most common character in any play. Puppet picked up in the hallway dressed as a military policeman. It's holding a pistol. Oh, great. What uh, fun. It also looks like it has bullet holes in it. Do you think, I think what? that might just be the design. Do you think that that other puppet, she said over and over that it looked familiar? Yeah. Is it the person who she reported? Oh, 100%. I a I 100% think that it is the person that right? she reported. It must, oh, it has to be. There's nine. What's over there? All sorts oh. of, oh, little kitty cats. Oh, hi. Like they look like cat eyes, don't they? Yeah, they do. Hey, kitties. Hey, meow, 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 meow mix. Aww. The art directors for the game were actually just like, yeah, we ran out of money when it came to animating these eyes, so we just took a picture of our cat and, and put a bunch of those in there. I think you're really thematic. Thank you. Here we go. Okay. Yeah, no, I, I think 100% you're right that this whole time, the, this puppet show that we're about to see mm. is the after effects of what happens when you tell on your fellow classmates. So the question is, is there any element of this that's real or is this all guilt in her mind? Oh, this is, this is probably all guilt in her mind, I would say. And that's what I'm leaning toward too, because it's also like dr it's all very dreamy, surreal. but like, I'm, I am curious if she actually killed someone. I don't know if she herself did. I, I mean, her actions resulted in people dying, I would say. Okay, in, I, real, pe in real people dying. Yes, her other, actions. Other than the one that she reported? It's like, did she actually kill Ari? Ari Way? Did she actually kill him? Physically? Yeah. I don't, I don't know. Here we go. All right. We'll find out. Let us see as we experience this puppet show together. Together. It's like a trick shot. <laughs> it's like, like, <laughs> through the head into the other head. Right? <laughs> Way to conserve on bullets. It's like you see in the movies. A it's, a de it's a good Deadpool move there, remember? Oh, it is a Deadpool. Conserved all those bullets good in the one. beginning. Good Deadpool No spoilers. Reference. Clap and a half Deadpool <laughs> reference. Well done. So this is the basement key, an old and worn bronze key used to open the door in the Red House basement. Oh, great. The Red House. The Red House. Notice that it keeps saying uh -oh. it's the Red House. That's alarming. That's where they keep the communist sympathizers. I think like so. the Red Scare. No, which, that's it is. Which what? No, I, I oh I was just being oh, explanatory. Oh, I thought you were no, theorizing. No, not not for you. I mean, <laughs> you no, you talked about the Red Scare on the last stream. The Red Scare, as in the the the. A great fear of anything communist related or communist sympathizers in the 30s, 20s, 30s? Not really, I forget. Anyway, um, so. I would, I'm pretending like I'm too invested in the game to answer your question, but the reality is I'm not 100% sure myself because history has never been one of my strongest suits without having to look it up. And so. that's and that's not an area that I know so. a ton about. All I know is that. <laughs> that's, that's called, that's called pro, like, that's called pro strategies of being a bad co-host on a live stream. <laughs> Sorry, Steph, I can't answer right now. I am so focused on this game. The red scare was sometime. <laughs> yes, yeah, Steph. Yep, you're totally right. I yep. thought I was just thinking to myself that it should be after World War II since since we would have been dealing with Soviet sympathizers and, and stuff yeah, at that it, point. It's right. But I'm not I'm actually not sure. So Red Scare relates to the red basement. Two red scares. When was the first and, and when was the second one? That's why Early I'm thinking of both of those time periods. Thank you. Well, there you go. Because the workers' unions had like some of their 
It was the it was the unions, right? That's okay, the, yeah, that's right. Yeah, all right. Huh. Uh, all right, so there here we go. go. We're back oh, in and of course the chat knows it was 50s and 60s, and then I was referring was the to the, 60s, the other yeah. first one in the 1920s. Okay, so there you go. There we go. The more you know. Nothing like a basement in a, like a, a torture base. So basically, we're going deeper and deeper into the bowels of a torture basement for, you know, communist sympathizers. And Sweet. Whatnot. This is all right. Cue, cue scary moment. Yep, and every um everyone in the chat is so good at history. They're all like the 1920s and then in the 1950s, which makes total sense. I always had a bad memory for dates and stuff. Like, okay, wait, sorry, something's happening. I always thought it was really interesting. I just never remember the dates about it. Okay. Wait, thanks for doing this for me. Mm. Not at all. <laughs> not not at all, bro. I'm always willing to help if you ask. Though I'm sorry to have to drag you all the way here to my classroom. Hmm. It's okay. My classroom has individual studies now. It'd be a bother if we were there. You're sure nobody else knows about these meetings, right? Uh-oh. Of course, miss. Absolutely not. One thing, though, hmm. this book list is quite sensitive in material. Please be careful with it. Oh... So, I don't know, it'll be interesting to see how she ends up in this situation. So, she's talking to Harry Way about, about, like, so it seems like she's actively looking for, like, the prohibited material, mm, doesn't it? Or, yep. like, she's trying to get into this inner circle. Either that or she's luring him in. Into a trap or something. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. Yes, thanks for the reminder. Ding. I know reading these books could be trouble. But it should be our freedom to pursue knowledge, right? Yeah, I'm with you on that. In fact, I think Miss Yin also said something like that before. Uh-oh. Poor Miss Yin. I think you're just like her. You're both courageous and talented. Suck up. You think we're alike? I can't compare to her anyways. She's the principal's daughter, and they're known to be a family of successful scholars. It's okay. I believe mm. she thinks highly of you. I remember she gave your work a nice compliment once. Oh, boy. She said, strengthen thy wings, the sky's the limit. Was that complimenting her work? <laughs> apparently. <laughs> she really said something like that that I, was completely unrelated, apparently, I, to anything that I actually did? I and turned it was in, really just a metaphorical platitude? I turned, in my, I turned in my math homework the other day. I didn't get an A, a B, a C. I got, strengthen thy wings, the sky's the limit. Put, that translates to a D. <laughs> In English, though, I'm doing really great because I'm getting a rainbow-colored alligator. <laughs> like, I, I five. I've worked hard to get there. <laughs> oh, it, she, I, I thought I said, said that already. Oh, hey! <laughs> she really said something like that? There we go. No, no, I was, no, I was, I was trying to be in the chat. Stuff. I was, I, I was. <laughs> you, you left me with an awkward high five. It was painful. <laughs> you looked good. Thanks. Hey, let me ask you a question. I see Miss Yin and Mr. Chang chat a lot. Do you maybe know what kind of relationship they have? So. Uh oh. Hmm. That's weird. Hmm. That is weird. Paper bag left behind by Wei. Oh. <gasps> There's your gun. Whoa. I've been weak. But you once taught me the pen is mightier than the gun. Whoa. Book club. Right, this is book the gun I was club for. reading list. With proper use, I could use this unassuming list to practically destroy those in my way. Okay. Ha. Huh. So that's huh. this is smart. Huh. I love this decision. Like, let me just again clap and a half to this game. It's a it's a reading list. But symbolically, it's like it's like a, a loaded gun, right? And what she chooses to do with that list will kill people. That is what I'm interpreting this as. Is that what? So the other interpretation, right? Just just to cover all our bit, is that it is it is an actual gun, but they're just using it. They're they're covering for the fact that they have a gun in school by calling it a reading list. 
They could be. I, th I think it's... I like your interpretation better, but that that is the alternate interpretation, right? Yeah. Like, oh, have you? do you have the reading list? Or how's the reading list? Or have you done anything with the reading list? Like, like that's the other way I could think about them handling it. But I, I like the idea that it's not really a gun, it's a metaphor. I Even though I was the one who wanted a gun earlier. Fine, fine, gosh. Right? Yeah, careful what you wish for, Steph. Right? You get a gun in the form of a reading list. Raven in a writing desk. Huh. Lost Soul says, love this game. Um, Cyborg Sloth 88 says, this is deep. Um, right. This this is Fox, slightly deeper than your typical horror. Game. Right. Rocks free says man this metaphor. Uh, Adam says interesting. Um, Suki Cupcake says it's all on a gun. The reading list is actually it's, written yeah, on the gun. It's, it's actually not <laughs> symbolic in any way, shape, or they have literally etched like catcher in the rye. <laughs> Great Gatsby. Nineteen eighty four. <laughs> Oh, hey. Oh, no. Oh. Wait, are we in the... Where are Wait. we right now? Is this the room? Let me see in. So we're behind the prison cell walls, okay. basically. Or the gate. Did we use the key? We're in the basement. What are you doing over here? As a teacher, I always show concern for students who are a little rebellious. Remember what you did. What? Have you forgotten? Or do you not want to remember? You... Just a harmless piece of paper, right? Instead, I had to die. He had to die, and many other students had to die. Is it you? You just keep causing me trouble. You're driving me crazy. Sometimes when you trip up, you're never able to get back up again. How dare you? This is all because of you. You ruined everything. If you had a problem, why couldn't you have come to talk to me instead? Shut up. If you were gone, none of this would have happened. Uh-oh. If you weren't here, all would be well. Ooh, watch your watch your feet. Be be careful. Oh, don't want you don't want you get splinters. Glass. Like glass splinters. <gasps> I don't know what a glass splinter is called. A shard. It's called a shard. shard. Glass shard. <laughs> Ooh, hello. I think that's what you call an aggressive reading list. <sighs> this is cool. Wow. Hey. Justice. Justice Chang Huang. Chang Huang. Hmm. Mom likes to bring all her worries and concerns to you. Something I think is fruitless. But sometimes there's no one else to help or to look to for help. My hands together in silent prayer. Here are my questions. I, Fang Rei Shin, invoke your guidance. Hmm. Ask about prospects. That seems like the most life or deathy thing. Oh. Oh, there we go. Wait, oh, there. Will I be able to live life by my choices and follow my heart down my own path? Ooh. Ooh, this is so deep. Yang Po, the laughing answer. So, I can only face reality obediently. Ooh, that doesn't sound good. And wait until God knows when. Do I have any other choice? Then I also ask about family. Mm hmm Will my parents who quarrel and fight have a second chance together? So these are like fortune telling, yeah. like almost like dice kind yeah. of, but not 
really. And you, based on how they fall, how they it fall. means it means different things. Yang Po, the laughing answer. You cannot cry over spilt milk. Is that so? But that was my family, my mom, and that person. We used to smile and laugh together. Hmm. Also, ask about love and alchemy. Didn't have to choose. Oh, good. Will I be able to live a simple life with loved ones and family? That's a no. Yin Po, the crying answer. Do not seek what cannot be. Uh, this was just a humble request. So I'm not going to be able to live peacefully. Mm -mm. You, can you can be so cruel. Yeah. Go ahead. Do I ask for too much? Is life just a never-ending bitterness? Or is it all just me? Divine answer. So it's because of me. Huh. Hmm. Oh, man. She's realizing what she did. She got some tough love there. Youth is hardly ever given a choice. Pushed through the grind until their inner innocence fades away. I've become a wooden horse on the carousel of life. A jumbled mess of lifeless emotion. Infused with frantic energy, I spin ever faster. So, was she in love with someone who Miss Yin started, to, like that guy that she's like, oh, what about Miss Yin and so and so? Yeah, I and think so. And so she got jealous and then used the gun, used the smoking gun of the reading list to. I think so. I think that's what it is. Yep. That, that's what, how I'm thinking about it, anyway. So, it started as something. So it's petty. not even. Yeah, that, that's the thing. It's not actually. The, when, as soon as she was like, um, if you weren't here, everything would be yeah. would be well. It, she was just jealous. Yep. And like, oh, do you think I'm like her? Yep. Do you know about their relationship? Mm -hmm. Yeah. It was a petty schoolgirl crush. Yep. That wound up getting like a bunch of people killed. Like in Clue, communism was just a red herring. <laughs> what? Yep. Oh, a radio! Seems like the static in the room is coming from this. Maybe I can get something if I tune it a bit. Sure you will. Do you know how to use one of those? Yes, I know how to use a radio tuner. Thanks, Jason. Good good to check. <laughs> Seriously. What? Hmm? I know how to do a rotary... F Here, look, I got... Look, and I can even adjust the, that if I need it. We're picking up Hawaii. Hawaii, you're coming in loud and clear. The atmosphere in the room's changed. Huh. Ooh, everything's upside down. That's awesome. That's really cool. Oh, whoa. Oh, that's crazy. Oh, it's a puzzle, maybe. I also wanted to check in on the chat really quick while just yep. while you're clicking through a couple of those. Piggy bank, broken up from one's desires. Rosalie Fire Up. My parents have those fortune things at home. OMG, I can totally relate to all of this. Huh. That's fascinating. Yeah, right? Um Pixel Girl Gamer, this is sad. Uh, Don't call it see. Scary Games Monday for nothing. Right? This isn't happy feel good games Monday. There's a puddle of clear water on the ground. Hmm. And footsteps. And is it dripping or is it footsteps? It's definitely footsteps. You can see right there. Oh, oh, you can see her. I was listening for them. Sorry, you can keep hanging out. I was just pointing out things. Let's see. Zoe Anon says, this is just like my school. <laughs> oh, sorry, Z Anon. Z, get out of there. Go, go now. Oh. What? I get it. So, Are the, these wa like so the water runs out, mm -hmm. but the footsteps keep going, and they didn't go far enough to get to, say, a third or fourth door. Right? Ah. Uh, so you Eight, go as far... Ten. Eleven. So that one stops at this first door. Okay. 
right? I think I'm interpreting this right. One, two. Oh, three, I see them. Okay. Four. Thirteen. It, it seems, seems like, like it's a store. Here. Yeah. Maybe it's where you stop seeing them, which would just be that first one. I mean, it seems like it keeps ending up on this door, doesn't it? If you go further, do you hear them for longer at all? There's a lot of doors, man. Yeah. There's a switch. Hmm. Nope. Switch is the wrong way. Is it? Oh, can you see something in the dark that you can't see in the light? I was gonna say, I wonder. Nope, just still dark. <laughs> the steps... The steps aren't even coming this time. Right? Weird. Okay. Huh. Let's see. Good to know. Also, should I test the radio more? Because I... This is... See, so the steps require the light to be on. Hmm. One, two, three. Unless he's taken like enormous steps. Right? Which I don't Maybe we need something here. See here, let the me The chat is also saying go back, by the way. Yeah, I think what they want to do us to do something with the radio. Yeah, I was gonna say let's do more with the radio first. Can I not tilt it? Oh, there we go. Go back, go back. Okay. Huh. Okay. Someone said go to the other song on the radio. So this is the one. Right. Where's the second one? There. There you go. So it's red when it's coming in clear. Mm. There we go. Oh, okay. I, I thought maybe. There we yeah. go. Piggyback. So this is back in time They're now. like, yes, test the radio first. Okay, good. Ceramic piggy bank. Big round eyes waiting to be fed. Okay. okay. So this guy gets smashed. Yep. And what else do we have to click on? Radio. Mm. <coughs> Someone's home. Oh, this is... Oh, boy. This is a happy scene. I feel like Mom's always been a traditional housewife. She doesn't complain even when wrong. I really don't like that. Ooh, that is... There's no mm. way to go into the past anymore. Even though we just did. Right? Fan! Ugh. Back then, besides the New Year's... Dad never drank at home. I miss the days when he had jokes and stories to tell. Nothing up there, nothing in the fan. I can't see anything out the window. Okay. Okay. Oh boy. Great. Okay. Mm. Okay. Mm. Pictures of mom, dad, and me. His eyes have been rubbed off. Ugh. Except for that one. Except for the ones that are flashing right there. Okay. Okay. Uh, let's make note just of, okay, so dad is first, me, and then mom. It's dad, you, mom, and then he's left, left up, up down. down. Okay, just let's remember that. Yep. That seems like it might be a, <coughs> a glass juice cup. Cool. That's weird. What about that light switch? Let's flip the lights and see what happens. Oh, Ooh. the eyes glow. Huh. Uh, so you have... Like, upside down L? L, eyes, one. L, eyes, one. Okay, good to know. 
Okay. Cool. Uh, anything else in this room? Glass juice cup. No. Oh, uh, yeah, I guess that's it. Door's locked. Strange quote is on the door. Meet the right person at, at the, the right, right time. time. Oh, boy. The right People want us to grab the cup. Can we grab the cup? We I don't think we can. We can do that. Yeah, we just, can, we can only it. look. And it doesn't seem like anything. Okay, so meet the right person at the right time. I wonder if we have to go through the door at the same time as the invisible person. Mm. Oh, or... Oh! oh! Okay. Uh, All right. Oh, boy. Oh boy. Unsettling, unsettling. Okay. Great. All right. All right, okay, cool. Wait, 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 hold on. What? The chat's saying we missed a clock. We missed a clock? Yeah, they're all saying go back. There's a clock. There's a clock. Look for a clock, it's either in this room or the other room. They're clocks, 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 clocks. Okay, wait. Not. No. Are the numbers for a clock? I mean, it could be. They're saying oh, the it's the hour. Are a clock. Oh, it's the oh, hour. Oh, I get it. I get it. So, okay. Okay. So wait, it's three thirty. Three thirty and of uh, seven thirty. Half, half past. Yeah, seven. Like seven. Three thirty. Seven thirty. Three thirty. Seven thirty. And eyeball. Three thirty. Seven thirty. Okay. Great. All right. 3.30, 7.30. Okay, cool. All right, that's good to know. Meet the right person at, at the, the right time. time. So dad is at 3.30, mom is at 7.30. Can't see anything. No way to go to the past anymore. Yep. Okay. So now we move forward. Can I not break my piggy bank? I feel like that's important. Yeah, I think we passed it. Great. Okay, now we're upside down. Piggy bank is still broken. So there's nothing I can pick up here at this point, right? No. So, no. Still just looking at it. Okay. All right, cool. Okay. 3.30, 7.30. Is, and is there a clock in here? seem like it, huh? What if we go back? Is there anything that glows anywhere? Right. Doesn't really... Nope. No, it doesn't really appear to be. Okay. All right. It's too dark to see anything. Yep, okay. Here, so let's go through... Uh, come on. Let's turn on the lights. Oops. Three thirty and seven thirty. Wait, uh, three thirty and seven thirty. Does it oh, matter that the pictures were upside down? But does it matter that the pictures were weren't facing the right way? I don't know. Three thirty. If you put, let's see, the dad was this way. The thing is, I'm I'm just not seeing a clock anywhere, or like something that it would relate to. And these are all. And this isn't anything. No. There's gotta be. There's something here we're missing. And I, I want us to be able to figure out some of it on our own. So I'm. I'm going to try not to look at the chat for a couple minutes, just so we can have a chance to figure it out. So okay, you can't go out the other side, can you? Because technically that should be the way to your kitchen if everything is flipped no, upside down. There, there's nothing. Okay. There's nothing in the desk. Is there anything on the... R there's no... Like, that's the thing. There's no, like, clocks anywhere. And there's nothing else on the radio. There's no way to tune stuff in on the radio, right? Right, those are the only stations, it seems like. What was the first station? Yeah. No. It's like 89 or something. I'm not seeing. I don't get it. Maybe around 
guy is going to be fed. I don't have money to feed him. Was there something in like the, the room? Can we go back? Was... Yeah, go back. Because we can't go back back to the school from here, right? We're like just here. No, no, we're here. We can't see anything out this window. What else could this be? Is there anything else to click on in here? I can't see in the past anymore. It's all just the table. Go back to the other room. The, the room with the pictures. I mean, this seems... Right, that seems weird. Like I should be able to interact with it or something. And I think if these are clock faces, we have to take into account that they're upside down and stuff. Maybe. So I don't think it's I don't think it's three fifteen. I think it's or three thirty. I think it's sure a different time six six forty five or something. Sure, whatever. That's still like where. What, what happened with it, the even juice if cup? It, even if it is, where do you input it? Is I the problem? Know. A I juice mean, cup. Maybe as the lights are off. Maybe. Meet the right person at, at the, the right, right time. time. So the time references Wait, are pretty clear. To, oh, maybe okay. Maybe I have to engage with it now. Okay. Oh, oh there okay. it is. All right, okay. All right, fine. Oh, come on. What's this supposed to mean? Yep. It's a fair question. Right. What's this supposed to mean? All right. So that way it would be 6.45 and What's this? one. It's still all... Okay, Two. This is all Two? still what it's supposed to mean. Can I pick up the juice cup? Yep. It glows with a dull melancholy. Ah, a dull oh, melancholy. Okay. Come okay. on, man. Fill the glass cup. Because you had to wait for the the picture to the bleed picture into it. The picture to bleed it. into it. So, Great. See, that's one of those like point and click adventure games. Where yeah, it, it you just got to mess around with it. OK, fine. Right. Fine, fine, fine. We got it. We so got we, it. So we have our juice cup. What's that going to do for us, though? Here we go. Filled with sadness and has a dim uh -huh. glow. My juice cup is full of sadness. Great. All right, Piggy Now Mary. let's switch to I'm something pour else. Pour my or... sadness into you. Sadness. I no. Okay, I, fine. It was worth a shot. I didn't know. I didn't know. Pour it on the radio. Uh, sadness. No. no. Okay. okay, fine. Let's... let's go pour it on something else. All right, let's hop forward. I don't think pouring it on the piggy bank is the way to go. I don't understand the piggy bank. I don't get it. It is weird that you can interact with it. So if Can you pour the colored juice into the puddle so it's not clear that's liquid? Why, that's why so I was going to say. colored footprint. Right, that seems to make sense. And then turn the lights off. Yeah, and then you turn the lights there off. There it is. There we go. Watch them go. I like, I like I my like, solution of listening right, to the number of footsteps. You should be able to do that. Here we go. Unless the person gets really quiet. See, okay, so it went into this door. I guess you just had to actually officially figure it out before it'll let you go. And now it went into this door. And now it went into this that door. door. Okay. And then it went into... Two. Back to this guy? No, no, no. no. Keep going, keep, keep going, keep going, keep going. Look, oh, look at that yeah. screen. It's much brighter. Oh, it is look, much brighter. Look, go into the oh, first there door. Okay. There you go. Oh yeah, that's the screen to look into. Yeah, in right. Ah, I know. Great. I stopped looking at the other one. Okay, now it goes back to this door. Yeah. Just giant door maze. There we go. Hey, we ah, did it! A lot of syringes. Oh no! Why did we do it? <laughs> <laughs> we did it. Why? Why did we do it? That's no problem. Oh, here we go. What about my poor piggy bank? Note on the floor. Add for private investigator. Whoa. Oh. Husband cheating, comes home late, we specialize in tracking people. This looks like an ad for a PI firm. Looks like an ad for... King Kong. Right? Some yeah. sort of like cartoon strip or something. <laughs> You'll never make a monkey out of me. It's like Planet of the Apes style. Uh, what else is over here? Oh, that's another that's door I don't want to leave yet. Let's go through this door. Things usually happen in the order that you're supposed to yeah, experience them. Ooh. Oh, oh what a... Whoa! This what a is oh, so this is strange. cool. Oh, that's wild. Oh, this is really disturbing, actually. Uh. Oh, how wild is this? 
I've been laying in bed, I can hear my mom and dad chatting through the walls. They had such a bond back then. I don't know when their idle chatter turned to deafening silence. Later, dad only came home when he got roaring drunk. Mom always huddled in the corner, trying to hide her tears. Oh, that's so sad. Okay, yep. Uh, wait, I can exit through this door? Like, quote-unquote door here? I don't want to necessarily... This seems like a symbolic exit. Right? No, it's in front of it. Oh, we're leaving the room oh, this way. Oh, I see way. what you're saying, yep. Source. Yep. Hey! Oh, hey, there we go. Okay. Okay, all right, we, we can puzzle. handle this. We know this. Okay, so that one on that side should be 6.45 if I've tilted the picture right. Well, so it started as... It started at 3.30. We said it was 3.30. But it's, I think we've got to tilt the picture. Right, so 3.30... Tilt it 6.45. 6.45, yep, good one. Okay, six forty-five, and okay. then mom's. Mom's was like seven thirty, so I think it would be like one. Two. It's one or two. Well, yeah, it's either one or two. I can't really tell. Two well. o'clock. Try two. Yeah. Maybe that's a bit wide. Maybe it's one. Yep. Hey, there it is. There we go. Nailed it. Good one. Good one with turning the the pictures the right way. Well, it was like the first thing we said when we looked at them. We were like, we have to remember that they're tilted. Right. We need that's top two. Right? Do I, yeah, do I need another cup? I, 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 this game is just all about vessels to contain blood and right? tears. It's all about off. drippy turn liquid. Oh, turn off the lights. No, you're talking. Oh. Whoa. Hello. Hello, mom Get and dad. Get out of there. Get out of there. <laughs> Hello, parents. Oh, no, I can't. I can't. Oh, do you can't. Do yeah, I can't. <laughs> hey, you collected mom's nightgown. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Dad. Nope, get out of there. This is, uh... <laughs> oh, my. This seems like a bad idea. This is why you don't load your room with black lights. Uh-uh. Nope. Don't do it. One day, Dad came home inebriated and tripped on the front door. I couldn't stand seeing him on the ground all the time, so I went over to give him a hand. Besides the stench of smoke, there was another smell, a faint smell of powdered makeup. Uh-oh. Oh, no. He was, he was a part-time clown. <laughs> Dad, do you have something to tell this family? Honey, I'm a clown. Ah, I couldn't bear to tell you. I was wondering why there were so many oversized footprints in our front lawn. What's your name? Bozo? Tell me it's not Bozo. Don't you dare. I found this. A rubber nose in what? the car. What was this doing in your underwear drawer? It's a rubber nose. <laughs> a red poofy wig. Oh uh, yeah. Cool. All right. Well, I'm. All right, I'm get out of there. My, yep. Time to leave my dad's infidelity. All right. Cool. My dad was a raging clown, mm. and I don't mean that metaphorically. He was literally, literally. a raging clown. <laughs> there we go. A slow, dramatic walk. He's getting a little miming on the side, if you know what I mean. Teacher's no. miming. No. Teacher's He's desk also, on it are no, plenty no. of assignment papers. Right, yep. Just going to choose to ignore that one. <laughs> Watch out for that plan. <laughs> That's a good idea. <gasps> no? Nothing? No? Come on. Come on. That's weird. Come on. I'm just playing. Give me something. Assignment papers. Mm. Yep. Assignment papers. Great. Yep. Yep. Those are things. Come on, what's going to jump out and attack me? Hmm. This is one of those moments where you don't expect to scare and it's going to scare you. It's also innocuous. Maybe I missed a bra or something. <laughs> Maybe I was supposed to pick up a bra, Steph. <gasps> or maybe go back here. Hmm. Maybe. Oh, now we can pick it up, though. Maybe? No, I don't think so. No? Oh. Nope, still the same. Huh. Oh my gosh, stop talking about the pig bank. Ah. So... Hmm. We know... Any new channels on the radio? I was going to say, yeah, is there a new yeah. channel on the radio, maybe? Okay. Because it seems like 
we exhausted everything there. I didn't see like I needed to pick up anything. Right? What happens if you're not on anything? That's a good question. Huh. Oh, you're back here. Okay. And... Fab? An old door. The door is locked. Okay. okay. That's what happens. That That is a good observation, though. So we need to do something to unlock the door, which presumably is going to be in that principal's office. Right? Or... There was that other locked door over here. Mm -hmm. Maybe the... Maybe this door is no longer locked. Maybe now that you've set time. Yeah, maybe now that we've used the... Oh, there we go. Oh, there we Yay! go. We met the right people at the right time. There we go. Oh, boy. <gasps> Look at all this black light fun. Right? So much black light fun. Ooh. Ooh. Now we've really entered Frambo. Right? This is it. They even walk the same. This feels like we must be like an end game Ooh, here. Hello. Oh, it's him. It's Ari. Oh, is it the counselor? Oh, it's the counselor. Oh, yeah, it is. Oh, we're at the counselor's office. Huh. I've received your paper plane. <laughs> you, you sent it through the air. Luckily, it found me via a carrier pigeon. Hmm. I was truly worried you were still having trouble at home. But it looks like my concern was slightly unfounded. Like the white daffodil, you are innocent, vain, and candid in nature. Ugh. Perched aside a pond in snow white, admiring your reflection. And putting in neon juice so that you can follow your own ghostly footprints. Huzzah. Being different from others can be a tough way to live. Sometimes you have to collect their blood. But I think I can understand that feeling. You said you want to learn more about my time abroad? All I can say right now is that my past is rather complicated. Hmm. Unfortunately, many horrible things have happened on this land in the last decade. Believe it or not, our society wasn't always like this, oppressive and cold. Perhaps we should take a stroll down the boulevard on the weekend. Oh, this is the guy I'm in love with! This is it. And then Miss Yin oh, gets my. it on with him, and then... No, Yin. <laughs> wow, that was bad. I thought that, that was, was so I bad. thought that was good. I thought that I, I'd give myself a clap and a half for that one. A little golf clap and a half. Don't encourage that. There are things our censored textbooks don't mention, but are definitely <gasps> worth knowing. Oh man. He's a sympathizer. Huh. Alright. So he's one of the people who started. Here's my paper airplane. Paper plane. Toss my worries out and receive your guidance. Hmm. Okay. Ooh, nope. Okay. And <laughs> the window <laughs> shut. <laughs> Somebody open up a window. Thanks, John Adams. Sit down, John. So where Musical can... theater references. All right. So where can I throw my... Uh... Hmm. I'm just going to try every room. Right. Here? Nope. No. Okay. Uh, in the future... Here. Oh, wait. Note. Oh. Bonus note. Radio station. Oh. oh, we got a new radio station. Oh, that's exciting. New radio station's channel. 103. Ooh. 1030. The wave. <laughs> <laughs> Can I throw it out my window, maybe? No. Ah, uh, ah. Uh. Show me. No. Okay. 103.0. The red wave. The red, the red tide crashing on your shores. <gasps> We're not communist at all, we swear. <laughs> there we go. Ooh. Classic. Mm. Classic. To each his own, I guess. The best. This is my favorite song, Steph. Oof. I remember the first time I heard you, saw you across the room, oh. this song started to play. Oh, the songs. Oh. Ooh, hello. Ooh. Hello, mirror puzzle. Whoa. Maybe. You gotta turn off those lights. Ooh. Oh. Oh, let me drag the pieces. It is. Right? It's gonna be a mirror puzzle. There we yeah. go. 
Ah! Oh, whoa! Look at, look at my dapper hat. Oh! Uh, what a dapper hat I have. Oh my gosh. It's a lot of mirror pieces. Ooh, they're okay. That one's reversed. Oh, this is fun. Okay. Oh Ooh. my. Oh, and that's ourselves. Oh, and that one has none. I'm a vampire. Oh yeah. Ray is a vampire confirmed. Still none. Weird. Oh. Oh, you know what it is. It's it's gonna be in reverse, right? Well, so huh. some of them get the guy going the right way, and other ones do not. So. Any reverse ones, you need to turn off. I mean, turn on. I... You think so? Yeah. Well, you know how he's going in reverse for you? The knob turns, but it won't budge. A strange note on the door. Follow that shadow in the dark. Then, then you will be, be closer, closer to, to the, the truth. truth. Okay. All right. So follow the shadow in the dark, which is... This fella uh, back. Oh my gosh, all the way back there. So here, like here. This is where we match up. Mm -hmm. so okay. So now go to the next one, uh, mirror and see if. Oh. But I'm following him in the dark. No, no. no you. Ne he needs to go the other way. I. I think we should try. I think we should try that. He needs to go the other way. Yeah, because when we're pointing left, he's pointing right. We need to be constantly running right. Okay, turn that one. Turn this one on now? Uh, yeah, turn yes. that one on because we want the reflection to be okay, running the right way, the basically. I, okay. I'm not turn sure either. Turn this one off? Why would we turn that one off? Because you see if he's there. He's not. Oh, see? just kidding. He is. Okay, he totally is, Jason. God. This one. Oh, he's going he's the right still way. He's going so the right way. Okay. So no, turn, turn that one on. Off. Okay, yeah. turn this one off. So now there he's go. going the right way. I, okay. And there it there is. he okay. is. All right. And now we meet each other. Hey! Good. Well done, Jason. Nice. Clap and half for figuring that one nice. out in such a hurry. Good job. I'm like, what are you talking about reversing things? Father's study is always neat and tidy. He always gave off an air of seriousness with a little bit of his own humor. Yeah, really that, that looks like That humorous hum part about... This really seems like a humorous yeah, household. Yeah, going out with other ladies. Ladies of the night. I'm just really excited to launch my paper airplane, honestly, Steph. I know. I'm just excited about the paper airplane. You were saying you weren't good at throwing paper airplanes when I'm you were not, younger. I'm really bad it at it. It took me a really long time to actually learn how to fold a paper well, airplane. Your piggy bank. Coin! Finally got yes. some some room for my piggy bank. Is that it? Seems All like right, it. I guess that's it. Ooh. Creepy, dirty basement area. The feeder's ticket counter. Oh, okay. The door shut tight. All right. right. So we need money. So okay, here's what's gonna happen, right? I give I give the piggy bank my money. And then it's we gonna, need to smash it to get to get we smash actual it to money. Get it back so that way we can go to the theater with my boyfriend. But he's not really my boyfriend because he's just a guy who's being nice to me. Yep. But I misinterpret that, and as a result. I result in basically my entire graduating class and uh, teaching staff getting killed off by the government. I, I feel it's like an innocent mistake. It's it's that classic tale. Tale as old as time. Tale as old as time. Tale as old as time. Red scare in Taiwan. There you go. There you go, buddy. I've been waiting for this day. Point hey, point in piggy bank. There we go. Do it. Doop. Now the interest matures on it, right? Right. Exactly. <laughs> and now when we go to the next time over and it's broken, we can pick it up. Right. It'll transition into the theater ticket, mm. I would assume. Or something. I'm assuming like something like that. Symbolically. Wait, where is it? There it is. There you go. Come on. Yeah. yeah called it. Woo Movie ticket. Ooh, what All are we right. going to see? If it's Suicide Squad, I am out of here. Right, come on. A saying goes, actors are a lunatic, and the act audience are fools. They shouldn't write that on their tickets. It really discourages the audience from coming. <laughs> <laughs> the audience are fools. There we go. Okay, back through. And out. All right. And here we'll go, brought her. No, <laughs> sorry, not in the closet room. <laughs> Here, movie tickets for everyone. 
Well, that was unexpected. I didn't think we were playing anymore, Soda Drinker Pro. <laughs> <laughs> hey oh! Soda Drinker Pro, I Soda played Drinker way Pro. too much of Soda Drinker Pro over the weekend. <sighs> well, this is cool. What? Wow. What is this? Steph, this is clearly... Oh, look, at some, some of those mochi, uh, or some of those, um, you know, those sticky rice balls? Our, that ice, they, our eyeballs. Our eyeballs. And that's not a cultural delicacy. Nope. That is symbolic. Although I've had, I, we've had those, the, the real ones, the, eyeballs. like... No. <laughs> Good day and welcome. We, we hope you enjoy your movie. Fool! <laughs> because you're an audience member. Lunatic! No, the actors you're are an actor. lunatic stuff. If you're working at the theater, you want to be an actor. Right? right? Acting! <gasps> that was brilliant. This is me acting! You lunatic! Look at me emote! Forget the theater, I just want to spend more time with the flying goldfish. Right, why are we going to see the movie? Right, when there are flying Outside goldfish. Outside is so much more interesting. Oh, hello. This one wasn't a popular one. I'm all alone. Mm, the Rotten Tomatoes reading on this one was fairly low. At the drive-in movie. It's a feeling that ain't too groovy. Alone with your teacher? Yeah, this is kind of weird. I don't know. Oh, oh no! Oh, and I got my deer pendant again. Did he give it to Oh, me? the achievement unlocked was more than a teacher. Ooh. 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 Around my neck, I'm sentimentally attached and dependent on it. Oh, no. Get rid of it. Get was, rid of was it. Was that a pun? She was dependent on it? Dependent. Wow. She was dependent. Anyway. Yeah, I'm sure that this is a game that's really making she puns like that. She was dependent on dependent. <laughs> wow. <laughs> wow. Wow. <laughs> oh, I'm here all week. Aren't you excited? <laughs> yeah, and you guys gave me a hard time about my whatever. My and Yin. No. I don't even give her a talk to the half for that. Oh, we have an angry man giving us a. Hmm. Oh, this is, this is bad news. Yeah, that's such bad news. Note on the floor search warrants. The chat is so grossed out. They're like, oh no, this is terrible. Anyway. A search warrant issued by the district court with a list of public officials involved in a bribery <gasps> scheme. When I went home yes. that day, father had already been taken away. I asked <gasps> mom what had happened. She quietly said, dad got his hands dirty, but he'll live. Huh. Hearing this, I felt as if she was smiling underneath. Oh, <gasps> she turned him she in. She did. She's like, oh. You have the side hustle of being Bozo the Clown by mm -hmm. night. And then you got a little extra song. Yeah. No one honks my husband's horn and gets away with it. Just... A wooga! Can we just... A wooga! A wooga! I hope you appreciate my pun even more now, Jason. Mm. So the wife got, uh, got daddy... Got, oh, he'll got live. Him arrested. He won't. I, yeah, right. He, he won't. No, he's he's done. So he's not. He's not gonna live. Assignment, Assignment book. book. Ooh, sweet. Math homework. A reasonable excuse to enter the counseling office. Wait, wait. Does this go back at all to when she was saying, "I don't want to be like my"? I wonder if I will be like my mother. I think she was more concerned about ending up as a housewife, I right? She not was a house, not yeah. like turn, ratting people out and turning them in. I think so. Yeah, I think that's. Uh, that's what I would assume, honestly. Mm. Oh, we should be in static land, because maybe this will open that door now. Oh, good one. Save. Yep. Save yeah. it. Here we go. The door's locked. Well, what mm. about this? That didn't do anything. Well, Great. what about this? That didn't do anything either. What about this? Nope. Okay. Here, you, you try <laughs> some stuff. It was a noble effort. I'm going to jump back into Twitter for just a couple minutes, because we haven't been in Twitter for a little while. At Ashley Hall says, Salt Peter, John. <laughs> way, to get, way to get the reference. Thank you for that. Uh, let's see. At Hunters 520, so she ratted Miss Yen out and got her killed because she had a crush? Maybe. It does It does seem a lot like that. Uh, <sighs> North Eli says, who in their right mind would shadow or would follow a shadow in the dark? Hashtag GT Live. You do have a point. There, there are a few logical inconsistencies in this one. Let's see. 
At Daisy Plyer says, Hashtag GT Live, you did good, Matt Pat. Thank you. That was nice. Thank you. So that much. was nice. And at Forchav KM says, Franbo 2 confirmed. Here we go. I think go. that's about right. This doesn't do anything either, really? Hmm. All right, keep trying. That's what I was thinking. Right? I was thinking, like, hey, if I go back to the counselor's office and I, like, kind of. Can you throw your airplane in here? Yeah, now I was going to say, maybe I do that? the plane. Mm. That doesn't do anything okay. either. At Edward Emberley oh, says, oh, God, creepy counselor alert. Absolutely. Right? Bad touch, man. Mm -hmm. Bad touch. Huh, that's weird. <laughs> At North Eli also gives the benefit of the doubt by saying, maybe her father is a photographer, hence all the black light. Clearly, that's what it is. I don't think so. Weird. What? Hmm. And there's a hand here for me to do something, it seems like. Hmm. Curiouser and curiouser. Right? Weird. Hmm. At Chet Jordan says you can try the assignment book uh, where the parents were in bed, like down at, in that scenario. I think that that scenario is... We could try it. Mm. Here, let's try Upside Down Land. Oh, maybe this, maybe this is... Ooh, we're getting some really good fan art from this one as well. I want to call out, uh, at huh. Carrot and Cacti. Oh, hello. Ooh. Oh, he's a little Ooh, fish. there's a person who has nailed there. <gasps> oh, no. Nailed it. Oh, that was me. Never oh. mind. <laughs> oh. <laughs> nailed it. Oh, no, just me. <laughs> Man, this recurring motif of the, uh... The, the fish. The, the floating goldfish. Gold huh? All right. That fish looks a little skinny. Oh man, I'm a scorned, I'm a scorned lover. Mm -hmm. Ooh, hey. Man. The teacher's desk. On it are plenty of assignment papers. Yep. Okay, so I guess I gotta go to the teacher's desk. Then. Okay. Really? Do these I'm, marks in the background mean anything? Or are they just marks? It might be. Oh. Like, I mean, it could potentially be references to cutting, I guess. But like, I, guess, but I don't, I don't know. It could just be like scary. Is the person gone? What? Is the person gone? There wasn't a person there. Yeah, oh. no, that was me. That oh. was that was that was the joke. I got it. Was I, I didn't it. realize that it was me the whole time. Ah, oh, got it. I didn't. Then I moved, and I'm like, oh, it was me. Ah, oh, I see. Yeah. I was, yep. Hey, Ray. Still on Twitter. Show some, show some urgency in your movement here, darling. Right? Oh, my darling. Oh, my darling. Wait, where oh. are we going back? Oh, I need to give him the assignment book? Yeah. That's what it is. Ah, uh, okay. There you go. Yep, yep. Here. Do it. Here. Do it. There we go. Okay. Okay. All right. There it is. Hmm. This is his breakup scene with me. Miss Fang. Miss Fang. The counseling process is near to counseling, counseling process. I'm glad you're back mm -hmm. on track. I'm glad that I have healed you through my, you know, special, and hopefully won't be needing me anytime touch. soon. <sighs> Oof. If there isn't anything new, you should uh, return to class now. I still have plenty of assignments to look at. Wow. Men, man. They're the worst. And I learned from my mom that what do you do with a cheating man? You turn him into the authorities to get shot by firing squad. Yeah, sure do. Damn straight. Counseling records. Mm. More of them. It's over. No matter what's been written on here, this There's... there is only farewell. Oh, man. Mm. Hmm. Yep, had to get rid of him. Right? So we've already done kind of my parents' room. So now, presumably, we're able to go through that kind of door, right? Yeah, I think probably. That's what we're thinking. Oh, there yeah, it is. Yeah, there it is. Oh, perfect. It's right there. Hell hath no fury like a schoolgirl scorned. <laughs> right? Here we go.
on, we're on stage. This is the stage play of my life. Oh, that's cool. That's a cool image. I have nothing to say about myself. I've seen this one before. <laughs> Should I give the music needs work? Should I give her a pendant? This doesn't no. do anything. Ah, no. Alright, fine. Give her counseling records. How about us? Yeah, there we go. Give her a paper airplane. There it is. Hey! A glass, glass cup, cup of nauseating color, overflowing with the stench of human corruption. Plates and cups clash against the walls as father's voice roared through the halls. Oh man. After a series of curses, seething, and all that's left is mother's weeping. Our family was once sweet together, healthy, caring, a healthy and caring when we gathered. And now, every night a restless sleep, every morning hard to wake, so it goes on day by day, the anguish digs ever deep. I was shattered into countless pieces, nearing the crumbling of a familiar world, in a state of ceaseless decay, plunging into a river of despair, floating in limbo for the rest of our days. So did Dad get back? I don't know. No. Here you go. Here you go. Anticipating when we meet footsteps ever quick and slight, roaming through a neon forest. Oh, we've been there. <laughs> right? Scrolling past the dazzling light. So is Franbo. Right? I've become a little lark, brushing past the pretty flowers, chasing all the playful butterflies. I glide merrily by your side. I've been an actor in our play, lunatic, long before the curtain's risen. Those fools watching! <laughs> Being held is ever comforting, longing for your love embracing, listening to your many whispers, feeling each other's tranquil breathing. The white deer walked into my grasp. What a pleasant surprise. What a turn of fate. What a... I want to keep this moment in my palms for eternity. There we go. Mm -mm. But, but nope, he said goodbye. Yep, he sure did. All of a sudden, we stopped meeting. You became distant bitterly, colder than the sun could melt, air around you freezing instantly, and my frozen body breathing heart, beating heart with each pulse tearing itself apart. See, and this is why you don't write poetry, man. Mm, rough. Love poetry. Right, she probably gave him this poem, and, and he was like, like nope, oh, yep, gotta Done. go. Again, I'm left in abject solitude in a house that I call home, in a space that I call school, a walking corpse whose mind's without a sense of loss that drown, that's drowned with doubt. And scene. Great. Obligatory standing ovation. Chang Min Hui. We need to talk about this. Miss Yen, it's not necessary to raise your voice like that. Here you can begin. Okay. Why can't I? What were you thinking going after a child like that? Ooh. Ooh. Child? I was already studying abroad at her age. <sighs> She's old enough to know what she wants. <gasps> oh no! What? Oh, creeper alert. Oh no! Creeper alert! So what now? We lead her down this forbidden path? Sounds like the path's already been I took the road less traveled. She only needs a push in the right direction, not for you to, to wrap your arms around her. <gasps> Gasp. They talk so poetically. Right? This is our private matter. <gasps> it's none of your business. Oh, how is it not? You're stuck in your little romance. Did you forget about us? Oh, Oh, man. a love triangle. Got left for a younger woman. Slip, slip, slip. Jeez. A little bit too young, though. That's that's, that's creepy. That's really gross. That's, that's not good. We were already in the same boat. Don't you forget? Oh, uh, commies. The commie boat. Mm, I think it was the, uh, yeah, I think the it The red scare been. boat. <laughs> Uh-oh. On the uh -oh. good ship. Anti-communism. Communism. Oh. No. Oh. Here's looking at you, kid. I was gonna say Illuminati confirmed, right? Uh oh. Cute spooky imagery. Uh oh. Oh. 
ready for the jump scare. Oh boy. A painful recollection. My soul is shattered in pieces. When I cannot put myself back together and forget everything, I open my eyes and welcome a barren world. I feel like this is the end. I feel like it must be, right? Right? I also feel like this has had a few endings at this point. <laughs> Who's this? Is that Harry? Harry? Harry way? Harry way. All right, goodbye. I remember this chair. It's a chair in a room. <laughs> Greenfield. Oh, I'm a ghost. You can see through me. You can? Uh-huh. Like you can see the top of the chair through oh. my waistline there, kind of. Right? I'm not imagining that. Oh, man. Yeah. And I have, what do I have? Search warrant. Okay. Hmm. hmm. Was it the kind of thing where she couldn't, she couldn't get past it and she couldn't go on and she... She's like in limbo now? Killed herself? Ooh, Did she hey. kill herself? Is that a lingered? What the heck was that? Ooh. Mm -hmm. Ooh. Oh, I can talk to you. Our life would vanish, but not our guilt. I am you. Yet you are not me. It's the sin that makes you linger in this realm. Huh. Memories like mirrors reflecting the true likeness of your soul. In a world full of pain and suffering, Fang Rei Shin, what do you fear the most? Oh. Okay, so okay, okay. Ooh. So this is the this is the end, right? Yeah. So this is like purgatory. Yeah. And you have to decide based on the journey that you've gone through. Yep. What path do you take? Do you regret what you did? Do you acknowledge and apologize and regret regret what you did, or do you stay kind of like selfish and not really getting the the mm -hmm. point of it all, right? So. Are you able to back out of this and save before you answer? Uh, right? That would have been great. Right? Shoot. Uh, do, do, do. Nope. Okay. Darn uh, it. Right? That sucks. Um, is, it, is it? No. So here's a question, just to make sure we're thinking this all the way through. The thing she's been most, most concerned about is living a life as her own person. Right. Which would lead me to believe that the answer to this is losing myself. Right? It. That's the one I would vote for. I feel like it's losing myself, too. It's not her life so much. It's, it's losing not her life. Her, who she her is. Her identity. And I mean, her family seems important, but she kind of hates her dad. I know, but this also feels self-interested. It does, but the only one that's not self-interested is her family, and she doesn't want to become her... Right, like she, she pities her mom, her mom, and she hates her dad. Right, so let's say losing myself. Believe that we are all born free. Eager to walk on your own path and afraid of losing yourself. You are me. Is that a good thing? I think that's a good thing. I think I am who I am, achievement. That's oh, good. Oh, that's, that's good. good. Uh, I. Oh, oh, see, we flipped. That's cool. Oh, interesting. Okay, so here, let's save. Yeah, let's do that. An altar for praying so that way we don't screw up anything. Huh. Because it, this feels like the final test, right? It does. Um, is it, like, am I supposed to do a challenge in Mirror World? Is there anything I'm supposed to, like... Oh, I, oh, I can walk around in Mirror World. Yeah. Ooh, hey. <laughs> okay. I like at Skel, Skel Jerome... Uh, 64, the fan. Don't you fear the fan the most, Matt Pat? <laughs> yes. I like that. I do. So this is where Ari Wei was at the beginning. Right. When he first walked out of the room. Right. Ooh, hey. Ooh. The way forward is the path to your, your past. past. Okay. However, the road ahead has crumbled. 
Lead me anywhere, and I will follow you like a shadow. Hmm. Oh, man. Your cryptic clues. Right? The door handle is broken, and I can't get in. Shoot. Lead me anywhere. That helps not at all. Right? Click on her. What? Nah. You want to click on her again? Cl click on her again. No, because that would flip me back into mirror world. Ooh. There oh, there it is. Yeah, uh, there it is. Okay. So now she'll follow. I ah. can't open this door, but mirror world should Here be. Right. Can you click? Oh, look. Here, let's talk to you. The sliding door is wrapped in barbed wire. It was. I can't open this door either. So can you click hmm. on her through the window? Through the window? Yeah, that's yeah, what I was wondering. Yeah, that's seems like Let's what we, we should do. Uh, Come on. I cannot. Go back a little bit more. There, there. No. No. Uh, so she, I mean, she's nuts. over there. So, okay. Hey, just so you guys know, mm. I know that this one's a long stream. We were really determined to finish this game. Yeah, today. we really want to finish we, it, you guys. Because we're in it, like we thought that we were like close, and we we were. It's, I think we're we in are. this like awkward middle ground. So right. thanks for sticking through with us. I know that this stream has gone long. And while you're looking around for a solution to this, I'm going to divide and conquer and hop into the chat. Great. Uh, let's see. Where Carolina uh, has asked everyone, guys, stop typing for wash one gosh damn second. <laughs> There is a lot going on in the chat. Uh, let's see. Jessica Delgado is first stream. Welcome. Uh, let's see. Huh. Alexis Marin says, make a new channel and call it Conspiracy Theories. Uh, uh, let's see. Oh, here we go. No, she's uh, and Butler, Butler Biatch says, I wish I actually knew what the game was. I just started watching. It's called Detention. It is a horror game about murder. <laughs> about and, and communism. And communism. And but Taiwan. mostly murder. And schoolgirls. It's on, the part one is on the GT Live channel, and we're finishing it up right now. Yeah, you can catch up on what you've missed, and you can also finish out watching with us. It, it's been really interesting it's, it's a, the whole it's way through. It's really well done. Yeah, it's a really good game. in every school activity, showing off your academic abilities, grabbing the attention of your peers and teachers. Then things took a turn for the worse at home. All the attention quickly turned into unwanted scrutiny. So you chose. Mm. I chose to escape? Grip? No, I chose acceptance, right? Because I, 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 I. What did we do? To turn a blind eye. You didn't turn a blind eye. Chose no, chose to escape through that relationship. Is that what they're talking about? I don't know. What do you think, Jason? Hmm. Right. So, so this whole game, we've I, been seeing. And she is. She has said that she never wants to be like her mom, who whose answer would be grim acceptance. Right. Her mom would be accepting. Yeah, I think her. I think it's escape. escape. It, right. I think it's escape too. Turn a blind eye. I mean, she I don't even understand what that means. That would really. be like I didn't help my fellow classmates or whatever. Yeah. She chose. So at the end of the day, she turned in everyone. I think it's to escape. She I wanted think to escape. So. The Maybe? world is immeasurably vast. There is always a place to hide. You are me. Oh, I think oh, we good. passed again. Huzzah. Huzzah. So each of these yeah. questions is like, and I wonder what happens if we fail. Right. Honestly. No. So it's like. Here's your final exam. This place is completely lifeless. Even ideas are buried here. Oh boy. Uh, Josephine Stout, if you had picked family, maybe you would have been able to travel back that path to the past. I wonder. I wonder if there are different endings here. There are burning books. Remember, remember to thoroughly destroy each book and add the spirit money to throw them off. There can't be any intact book pages or else this would be for naught. Right? Yeah. Hey, Way. Mm. You're closer with Miss Yin. Huh. I heard that she had to flee the country overnight. Is that true? Oh, no. 
Oh man, I'm not sure. She never said anything about leaving. I'm not sure. She never said anything about leaving, bro. Unlike Miss Yin, we don't have the connections to guide us to safety. Aren't you afraid? Well, actually, what bothers me the most is, do you know how the reading list got leaked out? It was me! Me! Stop asking questions. I'm as clueless as you. <gasps> Let's just hurry up and uh, finish this. We don't want to get caught, bro. Oh, they totally get caught. Spoiler alert. Let's see what you get got for making him, making him so laid back last time. A written verdict from court. Written verdict from court. A torn piece of the verdict. Chang Ming Hui, district level educator, is found guilty with students Wei and others of collusion with communist forces. Oh man. Chang Ming Hui is to be put to death after the court's ruling. Wei Chong Ting pleads guilty to affiliation with communist forces. Reading of prohibited texts with rebellious and corrupt thoughts. He will be sentenced to 15 years of jail time. 15 years? That's what it is. Wow. So that guy who was just on the stage uh -huh. is is him yeah he got out he just got out and he's revisiting the scene yep he's back oh wow mm. so what was the symbolic oh, here we go hanging and slitting his throat and that stuff I mean, she sacrificed him. I know. I, mean, I get that part, but it. What, but the, so none of that was real, right? The bonfire of hope is almost depleted, diminishing in the wind. Oh man! Oh, there's so a little reading here's the under, group. Here's the reading. Here's study group. It's the Breakfast Club. <laughs> it's For it's the communist, communist propaganda. Well, well, it's anti-communist stuff, right? No, no, it's com this. It is communist stuff. Because. It's socialism versus communism. This is communist sympathizers. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Some of the book contents might some of the book contents might conflict with your everyday thoughts. But the material will help you engage in reflective and independent thinking. Well, let's call it a day. Oh boy. I do want to remind you all again to never mention the book club to anyone else. <laughs> For that might put yourself and others in great danger. Oh boy. And Wei, I'd like to ask you a favor. Ooh. Uh -uh. Yes, Miss Lin. Yeah, Miss Lin, it's, is it yeah, about the new yeah, books? Yeah. Yeah, yeah. Oh. I've already given the list to Mr. Chang. He said the shipping company won't help us anymore, but he'll figure something out. Mm. So Chang was their supplier. Yeah. The government is enforcing restrictions on all imports. Oh, jeez. Soon, the book club might come to an end. In more ways than you know, honey. Miss Yin, why are things like this? I'm sorry, Wei. There is nothing I can do either. Oh, just one more thing before you go. Mr. Chang never brought us any of those books in the first place, right? <laughs> I know I can always count on you. So we're clearing him supposedly, or trying to clear his name. Mm -hmm. Blacklisted. Man. Return home for burial. Half a century in exile, blacklisted to return home for burial. During the period of martial law, Miss Yin Tsui Han was a... Wanted? Wanted, wanted political. political fugitive. Yeah. She was, hold on, that's my mouse. Ah. Wanted political fugitive. She was lucky to evade arrest and left the country only to be blacklisted. She traveled the world fighting for human rights and freedom of expression, but unfortunately died of lung cancer at the age of 50. Her last wish was to be able to return to her hometown. Now this wish can be achieved with the lifting of martial law. So that's what happened to her. She escaped. Okay. I apparently am not escaping the room, though. There we go. Harry Way. Exactly. Harry Way is the way to go. Okay. Well, there he is. Hey, buddy. I'm not your buddy. Pal. There we go. Oh. oh. 
we're, we're chasing him. I thought we got him. Oh, in the spooky bathroom. Uh. Jeez, can a guy have a minute of privacy in here? Nope. Got him. The note is barred on by a broom. And there's a note. Okay. Snitcher. Remove the broom. Sure. Is it me? Do they know it's me? Or do they think it's Harry? I wonder. I wonder if they think it's It wasn't Harry Way! I wonder if they think it's I wonder if they think it's Way. Ray's like, it's my way or the highway. <laughs> Would it have been him though? He, so he pleaded guilty. Note okay. to reading to reading right. communist stuff. Note entry. That time in fear forcing herself to breed hatred. Who knew that she would take that leap and leave this world behind? Nary a last word because of fear, remorse, the reasons remain undecided. I was left with a blur of confused thoughts spiraling through my mind. When I saw the sunlight again, things had changed drastically. My loved ones and teacher went to a higher place. She was buried in an unmarked grave, leaving me a decrepit man. Wait, what? My loved ones and teacher. So that's, is this? Could we read it again? Just real quick? That's Way's note, right? It should be, right? It's an excerpt. That time in she, fear. She would take that leap, leave this world behind. Is she talking about, is he talking about us? Is she talking about Ray? Who knew that she would take that leap and leave this world this behind? This world behind. So it sounds so like it's I committed not, suicide? Right, because it's not the teach, it's not Miss Yin, because she, she escaped. She died of lung, lung cancer. Nary a last word because of fear. I was left with a blur of confused thoughts. And I saw something, okay. My loved ones and teacher went to a higher place. She was buried in an unmarked grave, leaving me a decrepit man. But, I mean, what? I would, that that makes me assume that Ray commits suicide. It does. And, like, in the chair in the auditorium or something, right. you know, where, where we find her in the beginning. Yep. But. Do we save it? I don't want to, like. Yeah, I think, I mean, I think we, I think we save it. What if we were, what if we got one of the questions wrong? How would we know? All right. The only, the other, because, but to your point, Ooh, hmm. I was wondering if we had picked resignation, if that note would have said something else. Right. Like, are we choosing? There's a note on the carts. Okay. By escape, I more meant like, be a free thing. Oh, we gotta get, we gotta get her to go across. So we need to get her to stop, kind of. All to right. stop? Or something. Have so her we, run that way. Run left? Right, but we gotta turn off the light. Oh. Because she stops at the light. Mmm, okay. There we go. Alright. Oh. Come here. So I just need to do this from the other side. Yeah. Okay. Come, my shadow! Away! Away together! Let us solve this puzzle. We're like Peter Pan. Right, this little shadow. She, right. Anyway. Presume she's following me right now. Okay. Eric Parker thinks we're on the good path or the right ending. Right. So, so our right path or the good ending. There we go. Is that wrong? Did I do that the wrong way? Maya Clark is like, this is going to be a three-hour stream. I know. Yeah. I know. We could. I mean, we could always break it into two pieces to put it up on the on yeah, uh, in archive land live. because it's it's hard to watch that much all at once. But right. but as long as you guys are having fun, we. I really want to finish it. I do too. I really want to finish it. So wait a sec. What am I doing wrong here? We need. Apparently, to the chalkboard says linger in the other room. 
So this stops her, so I'm able to talk to her. So now... Max... And we don't want this on. Yeah. Did that turn off the light? This turns it on, this turns it off. We want it off. But, no, I think you want that on to stop her at the rubble. It, well, it started off as on, though. That's the problem. You think so? You stop her at the, at the rubble? What now? Yeah. Why do you want to stop the rubble? Well, I'm not 100% sure. I think... So talk to her? The door's locked. It can't be opened. Right, so we talk to her. Yeah. But then she's gonna... No, go back. Yeah, you need to turn off, off this light. So now she can walk. And we walk together. There we go. Now turn okay. into her. Yeah, exactly. Oh, turn into her here. It, exactly. I see what you're saying. Yeah. Acting immediately on one's determination, this is the philosophy he believed in, that someone should take fate into their own hands. Oh, boy. With you following him, what ideas do you hold? Take hold of your destiny. Live a laid back. That's not live a laid back life or submit mm -hmm. to one's. It's take hold of your it's destiny. Take hold of your destiny. That's an easy one. Yay! Huzzah! That is a charming. Oh wait. <laughs> so life has gained a goal. Next to him, you found yourself. You are me. Ah, oh, there yes. we go. Yay! Yeah. Okay. I, you fooled me there for a second, game. <laughs> Way to fake us out. <laughs> like, oh, I got that one wrong. No matter how many times this replays, nothing can be unwound. You can never redeem yourself. Hmm. Instructor by. Oh, that's you. Sorry. That was good. This is the book list I mentioned before. I found it on our teacher's desk. I have no words. Only periods. Miss Fang, the country appreciates your assistance. Mm. 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 There it is. Did you think finding something to rely on would stave off your fear? One day, however, he was gone just like that. You've lost everything you can depend on. What choice will you make now? Ooh. Not calm indifference. Try to take. Try to take, take them, them back. back. That's not it. Either. I don't think. I think it's. Accept, you, have think you have to accept, accept it. it. You have to accept it. Right? You've lost everything. You can't. You have to accept it. Calm indifference. Try to take them back. Quietly accept seems like resigned. It does seem resigned, but, but you, it's you also have accepting. To move on. You have to, you, you have to. If you're gonna make your own choices, you have to accept you them, right? You have to right? move forward. Yeah. I think quietly accept. Jason, thoughts? Quietly accept. Steph? Quietly accept. All right, let's do it. Let's quietly accept. Quietly accept. Uh oh, I have no words. Uh oh, I'm not me. Shoot. That might have been wrong. Uh oh. The chat also recommended that we say accept. Accept, please, okay, accept, accept. Annalisa says accept. Nightcore says accept. Oh, Danny wanted us to take back. Let's see. A lot, of, most people were saying accept. Ooh, we're on the roof. We're gonna jump off the roof. Ooh, hey. A little smoke on the roof, eh? way. Shoot. Smoking kills. Way and Chris, man. Hanging out. Smokes. Uh oh. Shoot. No, I think Take we're them I, No, I think I think we're good. I think we're good. I, yeah, people I the chat is like so the chat's 
feeling a little bit torn at the moment. We'll see how it we'll see how it goes. We'll see what Memories happens. Memories are like a mirror reflecting the true likeness of your soul. Is that a good thing? I'm going down. That maybe means not a good thing. Mm -mm. Maybe you still want to forget. Maybe you're still afraid. Oh no! I did that. I, we failed. Shh. This is it. This is whatever bad ending. Right? Oh yeah. This I is, think this is a this bad, is bad ending. ending. Darn it! I think I think I think we did it wrong. Shoot. We also got all scratchy. F right, facing your own aspirations, but not confessing to the truth. No. Ex we did. We wanted to accept. Acceptance means uh, accepting the truth. I am I you. I am you. Yet you are not me. Shoot! God oh, darn it! Oh, we messed up. <sighs> Shoot. Well, well, okay. Well, let's see through what happens. All right. And then hopefully we can we'll just get the bad ending, it. and then we'll yeah, then we'll go back. Oh, we were so close. Oh, this is definitely the bad ending. Uh oh. Oh, this is definitely the bad oh, no. ending. Oh no. Uh oh. Oh no. Oh, this is this is no bueno. Oh, this is creepy as uh -oh. heck. Oh. Oh no. Oh, we were we were doing so well. I thought quietly accept was totally the way to go. We were this close to not getting rivers of blood. Right. Constantly cycling over and over with only the river Sanzu at the end of your journey. Yet the knot of sin still lies unsolved. The bridge leading to Paramita lies in collapse. Oh boy. So the Requiem with a warm crescendo welcomes you once again. Oh boy. So we, we're basically doomed to repeat this over and over again. So this is, I have failed purgatory uh, and, and my personal hell. And we remain in detention. Right? We are, we are detained, literally, in hell. In hell. H-E double hockey sticks. Holy cow. Wow, this is, this is certainly the oh, bad Oh man, this is not H the feel good H-E -double, double toothpick certainly does go on a while. Apparently quietly accept is not... I, I thought you weeks you, like you have to who accept am I gonna your take mis it back from? right. You killed people I, and exiled them for I, life. I, I How are you going to gonna take that back? I have to accept what I did and and then and confront it. Like to take it back means I'm still denying what I did. There's nothing I can do. Right. What's this? Oh, we so get to, I, we're so hanging I ourselves. I receive an award. No, you no, receive a noose. a noose. You receive a noose. Oh. But this is what but this is what I think happens to me. Like did I receive like an award? I I do wonder if this is real. Did I actually receive an award for like, "Hey, you're a hero of the state." Maybe. You oh, you got a lot of people. I I wonder if that is true. Uh Oh, yeah. Here it is. Oh no, no, it's just pulling out slowly. It's just dramatic. Ah! Bad ending. Not so much like a school test where you can just kind of get one wrong. <laughs> Oof. As long as you show your work. All right, go back Oof. to the save. Go back to the save. All I want right. the good ending. All right. Get us out of here. Uh, yep. Yep. Getting us out of here. I <laughs> still stand by the fact that wait, if you for the credit story if here. you Dude, screw let the something roll. up unreversibly, irreversibly for someone else, you can't. There are things you can't take back there in are life. Certain, yeah, there are certain things that... The door closes, I'm sorry. Yeah, you... If you... It, seem, it seems weird to if say If you do something back. that results in somebody else's death, you have to move on and accept it somehow and confront it. You can't... Yeah. You also, can't just yeah. not deal with if it. This is, if this is something that is actually about like, hey, I'm no longer self-focused, I recognize the impact that my actions have had on the lives of others, yeah. I atone for those and I'm sorry, fighting back seems to like still be in denial about it. It does. So I, 
question. I don't know if that's the official last decision, and we just failed on the last decision. I also don't know if it may be a translation issue, honestly, or if, there, if mean, the wording may be slightly different. To me, I think what it boils down to is... If it's more like repent rather than try and make it better. I think what it boils down to is the problem that a lot of, like, you only get partial, like, you get the, the theme of the response when you do these sorts of things. Yeah. Where it doesn't, like, you expect it to be one thing, but mm. it doesn't actually play out the way you expect. Yeah. So Here, load it up, man. So the achievement unlocked there was everyone loves you, uh, which I think oh. is interesting. Uh, continue? Oof. Yeah. Yeah, continue. Cool. Okay. All right, so All let's right. get it, let's... Let's try again and get the good ending, which I'm assuming is not... I'm, not, I'm gonna hop into the chat. You you yeah, gonna start run, running around. I'm gonna try to run through this. Yep. As as Mad Wonder says, go back to save! Aizen Su uh, Suzuki says, hang in there, Matt Pat. Um, Jackie R says, this was intense. This oh, is, God. This is super intense. Uh, this game. Let's see. I'm curious to see how the good ending plays out. Eyes Cube says, guys, quietly accepts is not accept. How is that? Yes, it is. It's a form of acceptance. Whether you do it by shouting or not, like... It, it, it has to be. Here we go. So here we are. So now we go this way. We flip on. Rainbow Armada is like, wow, bad ending. Right? Uh, that, is the, that is far from a good ending but there. But everybody loves you. <laughs> right? Everyone loved me, guys. I got an award for patriotism. Right? Yeah, Bobo Bobodikin that? says, you are not her. Yeah, that was that was no bueno. Uh, let's okay, see. acting immediately on one's determination. Caleb Scott was like, mm, that was something, all right. Uh, let's see. Virtually Night says it means to fight to take the people back, but you killed them. Take hold of your destiny. Take hold of your yeah. You can't take back that kind of action. There's right. no going back. So life has a goal. Next to him, you found yourself. You are me. Okay, good. We pass. Pass that one. Z Z Z Talker says you done goof. <laughs> you done goofed. We done goofed yep. and. Jesse. Literally everyone <laughs> ended up in the slaughtered river of right? blood. Right? Jesse Patty says, welcome to hell. Nothing can be unwound. Juggernaut says, R.I.P. See, you can never, never redeem, redeem yourself. yourself. You can't you go can back. You can never redeem yourself. Thus, you must accept the truth. <laughs> sure, it might suck that it's quietly, but what you gonna do? I stand by my choice. Instructed by. Okay, so so I buy this. Bernard Chung says, the game is saying what she did, and Lucas de Brito Costa says, you would accept, she didn't. Well, she didn't, but this is, this but whole journey is about... But it's pointing us toward getting over it, getting past yeah, it. Yeah, this whole game is, hey, you have to relive this thing that you've purposely kind of blocked out of your mind. You need to relive it and Experience atone it, yeah. And, and grow from it. Did you think finding something to rely on would stave off your fear? One day, however, he was gone just like that. You've lost, lost everything, everything you can depend on. What choice will you make now? You've lost everything. Try to take them back is foolish because they have left you. They have left you. Right? You, he, he's gone, so it's stupid to try and take it back. That whole affair with the counselor was wrong. Yeah. That was not the right answer. So anyway, like, God. I believe that... I believe after, that this is the right this, choice, but it's like... After all this ranting and fighting, I hope so much it's just calm and different. <laughs> right? It is. It's calm and different, right? It's neither of these. Man. It's just like, yeah, just, just mad off. Try to take them back. Right. Jamal Felicia wants us to do the good ending. Do the good ending. The instructor's sharp gaze was stifling. You steeled yourself and performed without hesitation. In that one moment, transforming into a pitiless patriot. Easier than you think, right? You are me. So. How is that taking it back? Yeah, what, what happened there? Oh, maybe they're saying that by turning them in, you, you took tried it. to you take You tried to it take back. it back? That could be. Hmm. That could very well be it. I guess. All right. Amida agrees that. with us and says, "Yeah, you have to accept what you've done. You have to. You have to have. Uh, you. You can't go back. See, there are people who agree with us. We are back up here. Hmm. All right. Oh. Just, everyone's well, like, just take it back. Think like her. He's 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 smoking a cigarette though. Like we're going through similar 
actions here. Long what if it is call the difference? Right. No, we got you are me. Yeah, was... exactly. Longest live stream ever. Nope. The longest live stream ever was when we played Sister the location. latest FNAF game. Live. The whole darn thing. I, there were people in the comments who were like, I can't believe that the FNAF sister location was the most boring live stream. It's so like, that's because it was literally like five hours straight it of was... us just figuring out the game. It was five hours. Um, here we go. Yellowed paper plane from the white deer to my white daffodil, fate holds us apart. So let us meet again in another life to our freedom. Oh man, the chats, uh, there's so, so much talk about acceptance and responsibility in the chat. You guys are great. Open the door! Chang Ming Hui, you are suspected of spreading <coughs> anti-government propaganda. Smuggling banned books and organizing illegal gatherings. The court has already obtained the necessary evidence. <gasps> we now arrest you on the grounds of rebellious activities. No. Do not resist on pain of death. It's my beating heart. Hmm. Maybe. Looks like it. Looks like it'll be difficult to escape this time. Fine. Take my head so that I may join my brothers and sisters in death. <sighs> Why? Aren't people born to live freely? To think openly? To speak their minds without restriction or fear? Freedom of belief, love, and self-realization. Being with you was a happiness of the simplest and purest kind. I couldn't help but think when we could be hand in hand living an untroubled life. But in the end, this is only a fool's dream. You're like the audience of a movie theater. Mm -hmm. I too am vain like the daffodils fixated on my grandiosity. The world is not ready for the likes of us. I can't decide if I should like him more because he really cared about her or just be still creeped out because he's a pedophile. Daffodils died by a river of crimson blood. Decaying rust-like into the void. I'm way again. Oh. Construction signboard. Evidence of vandalism alongside many signs of protest. Metal lodging for laborers. Alas, to be demolished. All to be demolished. Barred from the heavens and hampered from the underworld. Barred from the heavens and hampered from the underworld. <gasps> Alone and wandering forever she goes. Well, that's me. Yeah. Pitiful. So it's because I committed suicide. That's why I'm not able to go anywhere. Yeah. So I'm like stuck in kind of that endless purgatory. Amnesty certificate. A certificate of amnesty. Oh, man. Wei Chung Ting. Type of pardon. Oh, amnesty. amnesty. Crime declared invalid. 
Mm -hmm. took, took them long enough, right? The large banyan tree has been cut down. It's weathered the storm of generations, yet it fell under the sharp edge of human desire. There's nothing else in my book, right? Sorry, just no, I think that's it. Oh, oh. Thought, I, thought I would rot in jail. I didn't expect to live past martial law. People say I'm a victim of politics. My crime was written off, but my youth is long past. Something lost can never be regained. Hmm. Letters from home, a yellowed le letter. My son, Chong Ting, even though I witness sickness and death on a daily basis, this still fills my heart with grief. Your mother's disease was utterly untreatable. I can only hope she died without worry and without pain. A person's body can be physically locked up, but your mind is always free to go where it pleases. Father hopes you can still get some peace of mind in this situation. Stay warm, stay safe, your father. Eventually, mother still passed away. Father didn't take it well and had to take a break from his clinic work. His written words were spirited and calming. They supported me during my darkest days. This is where he was. Yeah. Yeah. Fifteen years of my life were taken away by a piece of paper. I can still clearly remember when the military police came knocking and carried me off in front of my mother. Little did I know that was the last time I would see her face. Hmm. So this is... That was Miss yeah. um, Yen. After being released from jail, I haven't had any contact with Miss Yen. I couldn't believe it at first, but I heard she had passed away abroad due to lung cancer. Like with my mother, only after seeing her ashes with my own eyes was I able to realize I had lost a familiar part of my heart forever. Mm. It doesn't matter what I was feeling back then. Only pain and sadness remain. And so this is his comments yep. on that last note. Way to nail the ending. What a good game. <laughs> way to nail the ending, man. This is, has this ever appeared in any of those games for good lists? Or it, those... it just came out seven days ago. So. Oh. Or I guess at it's, this point, ten days ago. It's too early, yeah. This is incredible. This it's game. a really great game. This game was great. Yeah. <laughs> I'm like choking up. This is so powerful. It's fascinating that you walk through kind of the, the scene where your life fundamentally changed, you know? Yeah, the imagery is so powerful. They do such a good job. And, and, and the way, just the way everything set, gets set up and unfolds, it's really, it's really powerful. Because it's, it's a big, it's a big issue and it's a big deal, but it's super personal. Yeah. To the, the like two or three characters that you care about as you see it go on and that combination or bringing those two things together and even even the way everything is just like completely ruined at this point mm -hmm. and it, it's it also like it's such, such a good job of, of showcasing the futility of those kinds of situations because it's like if he were just in a different place at a different time if he just weren't in high school during martial law his life would be completely different and yeah. all of these institutions are now just you know yeah. done yeah that that your whole life has changed from one decision to, I mean, quite honestly, just be nice to, you know, this this girl, right? Yeah. You know, to invite her and try to help her, or educate her, what you know, whatever. You kind of want to think about what you, what you want. Yeah. Yeah, it's pretty but, incredible. And then to go back through and see like the years that have passed you by, and the vandalism. The music's and, also really good in this game. <laughs> right, and, and to, the sound is everything about this game was, yeah. was great. Yeah, this was an awesome game. But it's it's uh, if it's, you if you didn't get to see 
anyone play the whole thing, or if you did and you just want to experience it for yourself, absolutely recommend it. I mean, it's so good. And it, and it is. It's one of those, it's the other interesting thing about this is like, to, to him, this changed, like all, all his loved ones are dead, like he's never the same person, but it's, it's interesting to contrast against the vandalism, which, you know, treats it as like a joke or as disrespectful. And, and so to people who have no context, this place is, is just, you know, an empty building, decrepit and stuff. Right. And, uh, oh, here, you can interact with that. Yeah. You take your seat one last time. Yeah, I figured. Good game. Yeah, that was. You don't expect that one out of Scary Games Friday, right? Yeah, Scary we Games Friday. Save that one for Tear Jerker Monday. Yeah, Scary, scary <laughs> Games Friday is like, oh, it's another FNAF game. What am I? Not like, oh, let's have Tattletale. Actual, like, <laughs> right? Oh no, it's an evil Furby. Not wow, I'm having like. <laughs> like a very visceral reaction to like a very serious game. Yeah. It was awesome. So awesome good. job. This so, was fantastic. So good. And the ending didn't, like, the ending didn't let anything down. Like, it didn't mm -hmm. let anybody no, off easy. Ending, like, it just... It was very fair. Yeah, it was. It was extremely fair. She's kind of caught in her fate. He has to live with kind of the impact of his decisions. Yeah. You see them kind of both reliving that moment. Yeah. Yeah, they both relive that moment, and they're both... Connect. They're both like the only thing that the other one has to connect to, actually, which is really interesting as well. Yeah. And we're educated more about, you know, that period in history. Get a little sense of like the personal impact that it had on people. I mean, people. that's why it's so effective. That's why these kinds of things are so effective because history is just textbooks until you put it in until you put it in the perspective of individuals, yeah, right? Yeah, it, it, it's, it's meaningless, right? But yeah, Num numbers of, of people are mean, like, oh, thousands of people were imprisoned during, you know, during totalitarian regimes and stuff like that. And you don't, you don't think about what those numbers mean as each individual person, right? And yeah. this did such a good job of, of bringing that so up close and personal. Yeah, no, I mean. Good job, Red Candle. Absolutely. Clap and a half for you. Cool. Yeah, that was tremendous. Uh, very one of I I would say one of the best games that we've played. I think on, so. On the live stream. Absolutely. Achievement Absolutely. unlocked is back to school. Woo! -hoo. So. All right. There you go. And with that, we have two minutes to go until this is a three-hour live stream. Woo! So thank you so much for hanging in there with us for sticking it out and for experiencing this game with us because this was one of those rare games that is really impactful and you know lots of games scare us or make us laugh or we get to make fun of them every day yeah. or something like that but there are a few that are at a whole different level and this is one of them so thank you yeah it's it's true like this isn't necessarily the easiest game you know it's not easy to classify as just a horror game it's not easy to classify as like oh it's just a point and click adventure it, it takes time and it's it's stuff that is foreign to a lot of us but if you give it a chance and you know you you come at it with an open mind like it's it can be really like this demonstrates the power of video games mm -hmm. right this is the value of putting you into someone else's shoes making you go through an experience cuz this told through a movie or through a book or whatever would feel very different mm, so. oh yeah it would and remember, that's just a stream. A live stream. Thank you for sticking it out and staying thoughtful with us. See you tomorrow. Say goodbye in the chat. Indeed we shall. Uh, Becca Gann says bye. Really great game. Sila Zilla uh, says goodbye fam. 
Uh, let's see. Cryomancer says, sad pat, sappy pat. Yeah. Beyond Seek says, don't cry, mad pat. <laughs> uh, CISO Seiya09 says, hashtag, I need a hug. Isabel RP says, wow, bye. XX Abby G X X says, please do that dragon cancer. Tried to. We've tried to We've last tried week. We've we'll tried like try three times. Week. Well, don't worry. <laughs> uh, Jesse Campus says, bye. Jesse L, what an experience. I agree. 